Welcome back, guys. Uh, another day of Pokemon Emerald. Is Fineapple the same route as Twin Peaks? Let's take a look. Where's the map? Is it Pokenav? Yeah. So we start here. I think you're right. Yeah, we can't use we can't use pineapple. You're right. You're correct. Met it on Route 103. Yeah, we can't use pineapple. Brutal. Brutal. How's that? make the rules. I just follow them. Alright. So, I think we go back to... Uh, do we go to Bambusmon, or do we take... Because uh... Bambusmon has the exact same type coverage as Boombox does. Uh, whereas Sandakin would be our only defense against a fire type. Right? Like, a fire type kind of sweeps our team. What's up, Egg Benedict? Uh, that is true, Fa Fratriarch. Um, but also, Bambusmon is, uh, already pretty much maxed out. It's not gonna get better than Hyper Voice High Jump Kick, I don't think. Um, and what's more, uh, no type coverage, uh, that is new. Whereas, Sandikin does have type coverage that is new. So... The fact that Sandikin has Mud Shot, pretty solid defense. I mean, he hasn't evolved. Sandikin is also a baby. Um, so I believe Sandikin's rejoining the team here. We can evolve Sandikin. Uh, that should uh, that should make her a bit more usable. Sandikin can win without the high ground, because Sandikin is the high ground. Uh, how randomized is it? Random moves? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and also Sanity. Um, Alright, so let's let's get back out there. Um, so the, the moves are randomized preferring type, though, Scott. So um, it's not full random, and that's why you'll see a lot of Pokemon with moves that kind of make sense. Soft Sand or Quick Claw? We've got 453 quick, quick claws. Uh, let's let's give one to Sandikin. Yeah, canceling the evolve to get two moves. Um, one time for Sandikin. Well, actually, our lowest Pokemon right now is uh, Ed Clamps. Our Brandis Brandis New is what I was just about to say. Uh, I did say it. I don't know why I said about to when I when I did indeed say it. All right, we just fought these two, and I believe we fought everybody over here, but we're going to go check and see what's going on. How's everybody doing this Sunday? Heart-stirring melody, dude. What's up, Solo? Is that enough quick claws? You should look for more. Yeah, extra extra moves by, by waiting a turn to evolve. I always, I always remember this uh, Kecleon there. It's a classic. There's a Pikachu there and a Zoomeral. 
Um, I think I, I think I got that one. So, uh, is this kid a trainer? I feel like he's not. Yeah. That's right, he says the air is tasty here. I remember this kid. He's a weirdo. Okay. Dun, 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 dun. Okay. Um Well, we have Silver Wind, which I believe is he grass psychic or is he just grass, Celebi? I think he's grass psychic. Oh, amazing. With solar beam. Thank God we're going to one shot him. Um Favorite generation? Third is my favorite generation. Oh, thank you, 3D Octopus. It won't distract me. Don't worry. Third is such a good generation. It's such a good generation. Uh, all right, triathlete Maria. Okay. Um, continue to train, train Ed. Fifth is a close second. I think fifth was when I stopped playing. Um, but it was like, I was like in college at the time. So it was like a, just a, more of just like a shift away from Pokemon in general. Um, okay, so he's pure poison type. I'm steel bug. Let's take the fight. Um, audio was a little loud in my ears there. Welcome back. Endeavor, you say. Uh, welcome back, Zed. Good to have you, bud. Uh, black, white, or black, two, white, two, random lock. I don't think I can randomize a game I don't know. Unfortunately. Water. Go to grass. Gulpin used to be your favorite Pokemon. What happened? Did you discover any other Pokemon? <laughs> Sorry. I'm not buying Pokemon Snap. Pokemon Snap, I, I never... A uh, little bit of auto-tune got redeemed, folks. A little bit of auto-tune got redeemed. A little bit of auto-tune. Got a little bit of auto-tune enabled, folks. Um, 11 months might be the best, but 12 is my favorite. What's up, Peepa Sheep? Oh. Oh, well, oh, hello, Phil Jr. My uncle bought me a Pokenab. Now I can get in touch with you anytime. Goodbye. <laughs> that sounded like a threat. I can get in touch with you anytime. Do you know why they named Gulpin Gulpin? Gulpin D's nuts? Is that, is that what's going to happen? Um, a little bit of auto-tune just got it activated uh, by Brown Bearded One. All right, right, moving on out. Gulpin D's nuts. Gulpin D's nuts. Gulpin D's nuts. All right. Um, I'm a little afraid to put Sandikin and Ed Clamps in battle together. Uh, but without risk comes no reward. Lady, I thank you very much for the gift sub to Heepa Sheep. Appreciate it. Concentrate on getting the win. That's how I battle. Isn't it nice to battle while looking at pretty flowers? They wrote such long pieces of music for the... I guess it's not that long, it's just... It, it's, it's long enough that it's surprising. All right. 
Uh, one Pokemon each. Pichu, great. Vaporeon, not as great. I think we have to switch Sandikin out even though I would like to not. Just because if Vaporeon hits him with a... If, if Vaporeon smacks him... Lady of Hugs, thanks for another gift sub. Um... We're gonna go for this... Mm, is Bug not very effective against Electric? That doesn't make any sense why it would not be effective on Electric. Bug's neutral against Electric, right? Had to overtake Joe's and my best friend and sworn rival. Neutral. Okay, cool. Switching Sandikin for... Man, Ivy League is our leader now. Um, I think we go to... Yeah, we go to Ivy League. Oh, Vaporeon's got a great sprite. Hey, Zed! Thanks, buddy. Subscription. Gifts up to Freight Chair. Appreciate it. How's everybody doing this Sunday? Yeah, that water gun probably would have been dangerous, and if it crit, it might have been lethal. Um, go ahead and kill him. It's about to be a 115 degrees? Stay safe, bud. That's, that's, very, that's a high temperature. Especially if you're talking Celsius, am I right? Ed Clamps is trying to learn Sky Uppercut. I think we'll probably get rid of uh, Leech Life for Sky Uppercut. Um, I get that it's not like the best move, but it's a very good move. 85 power, high accuracy. Um, we're getting rid of Leech Life. Twin Needle has good PP if we run out of Silver Wind. Um, Leech Life sucks. Uh, Leech Life is greater than Sky Uppercut. It is not. Um, it's not the best, but Leech Life is the worst. Those clamps got hands, dude. What was, what was the full Ed? It was like Edward versus Clamps, and then it got a tie, and so now his name is Ed Clamps instead. Sky Uppercut can't heal you. Yeah, that's like, that's like, uh, how I play roguelikes. I'll take the, like, <laughs> I'll take the, the attack that has, like, one-fifth of the power because it can heal me, and it's usually the right choice. Oops. I, um, hit the instant pause, uh, thing. It is not broken, Crossberg. Uh, a little bit of auto-tune was activated. Um, we probably have one more battle of auto-tune, um, and then we will be off of the auto-tune. But for now, we're on the auto tip. What's up? Let me demonstrate the power hidden within a psychic Pokemon. So typically she would have unknown, maybe? Oh, I remember this sprite. I remember this sprite. Surskit! Surskit, baby! Are the casino TMs randomized? They should be, yes. No, not Twin Needle. Surskit is very cute, and also a bad Pokemon. <laughs> Subscribed. That's great. Time flies. Hey, thanks for subscribing. Hey, hey, thank you very much. Welcome back, Liz. Four months, yeah. That's wild. Hope you're doing well. Your puppy is the cutest. Yes, he is. He's on a walk right now. Um, but he is very cute. Um, and thank you for saying so. Uh, what was I about to... I was about to... Uh, thank you for the bits. Thanks for the hype train, guys. I missed the hype train when it started. But I appreciate it. Um, I love how this is just a recolor of soft sand. Uh, the bag is green. And the powder is bright. Also, uh, I'm going to give you this bright powder, which casts a glare to reduce accuracy. And I'm just going to put it in a nice little pouch for you to hold so that you can't see the bright powder. Um, and somehow that's still going to 
Do I need to do it? Oh, that's what I was going to do. I was going to turn off auto tune. Thank you. Whose accuracy does it reduce the the opponents? Not not your Pokemon. What exactly does a hype train do? It is uh, if you participate in the hype train, uh, which is like 100 bits or a subscription, you get uh, an emote permanently. And I believe most of the emotes are um, like dog emotes right now. I'm very glad on this route that we caught a scissor instead of a Caterpie, because I might have gone insane if we got a Caterpie. Uh, actually, this is gonna be this is gonna be stronger because it's neutral against Caterpie. Yes! All right. Um, that would have been cool too. I'm gonna be honest. I would have used a Grump Pit Pig. Bits. I would have used a Grump Pig. Did. <laughs> okay, Liz. Thanks for coming by. We will note that you are lurking. Nice. Nice. Thanks to our cool for the bits. What's up, Wix? Is it bad that you pirated my show instead of subscribing to Disney Plus? Um, you know what? I'll talk to the execs. See if see if that's bad. Let's. I'll, I'll talk to the execs at Disney and see if they approve of pirating. <laughs> I'll do. I'll do a little. Uh, a little charm on him. Lady, uh, thank you for the hundred bits. Uh, too bad Scissor doesn't have Technician ability. That Twin Needle would be strong. Uh, what is Technician? Oh, Technician is the one where it's like stronger, um, str weaker moves are stronger, right? And that's why he's really good with Bullet Punch. I I agree that Sky Arpacut is very cool. Um, Startles the Pokemon that appealed before the user, and works great if performed first. Okay. They made like five movies about pirating. Nice. Very nicely done. Ex nice execution. Nice. Stuck the landing there. Um, Alright. Scissor. Let's keep it up, bud. Should I tweet, guys? Should I tweet? What do you think? Is it tweet time? I always knew Scissor could use a lot of cool moves. He could, yeah. Bullet Punch is, bullet punch is like, a good move. Tweet, because I got to go soon. And that tweet will keep you here. Right. Um, let me tweet real quick. I will tweet. I will tweet. On the Twitter.com website. All right. URL has been typed. I I am playing a Pokemon game where if they faint, I have to send them to hell. Also, everything is random and nobody is nice to me. Okay. <laughs> you can watch it for $500 at which just kidding, it's free. <laughs> nice. Thank you for the 69 bits, Tri Bananas. Choo choo to everybody who was in on that hype train. W wasn't there a hidden item in one of these things? I vaguely remember a hidden item in, in these things. I remember these trainers that spin in a circle. Um, I, I appreciate them so much in comparison to the ones that are just rando. Fine Apple was uh, illegal. We caught Fine Apple on the same route as we caught Twin Peaks at the beginning of the game. And so Fine Apple is unfortunately illegal. Six folks. This lady got six folks. One folk down. 
Ah, oh, I, was, I was wrong. No folks down. Alright. Uh, Nidorina, next Pokemon is going to be uh, Clefairy. Next Pokemon is Clefairy. Guarantee it. Guarantee this Pokemon is Clefairy. Just like I said, next Pokemon is Barboach. That's what I said, right? I forget. Um, go ahead and, let's see, Ground Water. Let's just do Swift. I guess if he has Earthquake, it could be, like, not great, but we got him. Okay, next Pokemon is going to be uh, Clefairy. Right, like I said, Dugong. All right, um, we're gonna go ahead and Sky Uppercut the Dugong. Nice, we got him, we got him, we got him. All right. That's a level up, that's a level up. We're up to level 18. We started this training day at level 15. Uh, like I said, Pichu, okay. Hit him with a Swift here real quick. Got him. All right, this next Pokemon here, um, it's going to be a Clefairy. Yep, yep. Uh, we know that Sandshrew does not have Earthquake, so we don't have to fear Earthquake. Dude, I'm, I'm nailing every one. It's wild. It's wild. Ed Clamps, Ed Clamps, Ed Clamps! Okay, we took down the took down the Sandshrew. And finally, of course, it's closing out with a Clefairy. Okay, just like I said, Dragonite, Dragonite here. Um Dragon Flying. Flying will be neutral. He's level 12. We can take him with Ed Clamps. Not barrage. Okay. shaped like a friend. I would agree with you. I would agree with you. Pokemon Emerald Battle Theme. Ed Clamps version. Ed Clamps Remix. What? Didn't I just fight? Didn't she have six Clefairies? <laughs> You're lying to me, right? He had... I'm pretty sure she had six Clefairies. Are you trolling me? Okay. All right, 3D Octopus. All right. I'm not sure what it means, but it does have a lot of the same sound in it. little wheelie action for you guys can you can you even believe it peep that battle tent debut in this town wait battle tent in this town is this emeralds specific The, the battle tent is different than the fashion show, right? Is there a word for the effect where buildings are bigger on the inside than on the outside? I don't know, but it is definitely a cartoon thing. Battle tent is emerald. Okay. So what does the battle tent do here? Should I just go see it? getting used to you but that's the scissor let's see how much uh boom box our uh, our new starter <laughs> likes us very happy likes you a whole lot okay so it's not it's not max but um it's up there uh let's get sandikin in front ed clamps is now level 19 you don't get money or experience okay so it's nothing all right phil jr well he's next door next door Who refers to another room in their house as next door? Could be Pokemon that are giving the boy hope. I'm not 
feeling down anymore because I have a new purpose in life. Together with Ralts, I'm going to challenge Pokemon gyms and become a great trainer. Please watch me. I'm going to be stronger than you. When I do, I'm going to challenge you to another battle. Wally is going to get strong. What, Ralts? You're crazy, dude. You're literally crazy. Uh, far away, deep in the Ever Evergrande City. I forgot that's the name of it. Uh, trainers who get it are all frighteningly well-skilled. Um, I think the rules say you have to battle them all in a row. If you lose any of them, you have to begin your challenge again from the first one. Yeah. Uh, and for me, I have to begin my challenge again from a while back, because I'm going to have to train an entire new team if I lose to the Elite Four at all. So, um, noted. Anything in here? <laughs> this kid is going to teach someone sacred fire? But maybe not, though. It's not going to be Sacred Fire, fire is according to the last one. So Swagron doesn't have four moves, so let's see what this is. It's actually Sacred Fire! <laughs> this child can teach Ag Agron Sacred Fire! Okay, I, I'm going to hold off because... I think Agron's... Um, we're not on the safe wavelength. I mean, we will be. Uh, his special attack is 27. <laughs> like. Oh my god, that animation for Exploud? Do his eyes widen? They, uh, they widen his eyes! That's spooky. Dude, Explode is scary, dude. Not scary. Very cute. Explode is scary, though. I love this team, dude. Um, I don't think we can teach Agron Sacred Fire, dude. The only reason people visit this town is the battle tent. It goes without saying. Damn. You hate your town, huh? Uh, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and put Sandikin up top. Try to get him a level or two here. Have any good fire Pokemon in the box? <laughs> this grass is nuts. It's got Scissor, Altaria, that Psychic Pig guy. Um, it is the same cave as Pico. It is the same cave as Pico. And Caterpie, dude! N l lest we forget Caterpie. Um, where do you forget moves? By the way, uh... Do I want to forget Cut? I'm trying to think if I want to forget Cut. Oh, is there a trainer in the cave? Hell yeah. All right, I'm confused. Who gets the $500 that I spent to watch? What's up, bud? Come from Twitter? All right. Um, the, the highlights are starting to be edited. Um, as you might imagine, um, it takes a while, particularly when I have a little dog. Is there still background music running? Yes, there is. My bad. That's my bad. That'll be throughout a lot of it. South Branch just left of cave entrance. Who's this? So you're lying to me, Fratriarch? Wow. Alright. I see how it is. No, I see how it is. <laughs> okay, Slowpoke. What's up, Ivy League? Not Whirlpool. One damage. And then three damage from the Whirlpool itself, right? Maybe four? Three! I'm so good at this game, dude. Leaf Blade, cut up this little man. Goodbye. Oh, goodbye, little man. Who's next? Sandikin's level 19. Nice, 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 nice. 
those horrible levels. Yeah, you're done. Ivy League rules very hard. Great type coverage. Got Spore for, like, guaranteed sleep. I will be heartbroken if we lose a second Ivysaur and it's this... this fella. Um, yeah, just leap blade. Might not be a one hit, but should be a two hit. KO. Done, dude. Yeah, defense curl. Great move, bud. Great move, buddy. Smart. Get out of here. Get out of here. All right, level 24, Ivy League. You'll love to see it. Our starter essentially has returned to us and is one of our highest level Pokemon. You do love to see it. Um, for those who are joining for the first time, uh, our starter was a Bulbasaur, uh, and we lost our Bulbasaur to a Dragonair who swept almost our entire team, if not for Boombox, getting a lucky, uh, two lucky Quick Claws in a row and barely taking him down. Um, that is the, the lore of this stream. I dropped my glasses. That's so funny. That's so funny that he recognizes that I found black glasses, because that's what this is typically. But I found it before I found the item. I didn't explain that well, but... You can't help him, right? Or can you? You have to put him out of his misery. I just gotta kill this guy. There we go. A king's, the bag is full. I forgot about the frickin' bag is full, dude. What a horrible mechanic the bag is full is. In a Pokemon game. All right, let's give some, I have three Zinx somehow. Um, let's give three Zinx to Swagron so we can get some special defense on him. Pump him up a bit. King's Rock is indeed a flincher. And as a, as a result, we are gonna give it to our highest speed Pokemon, which I believe will be, yes, Murkrow. Oh my lord. The bag is full, dude. I just cannot believe the bag is full. up t2 coming from tiktok did you did you hit the link from my tiktok i switched the link from my tiktok from my website to my twitch because i feel like it's it's more readable you know um what can i get rid of energy root eh, shell shell heart scale i mean i could get rid of the heart scale can, why can you not carry more pokemon in the bag instead of 30 apricots Black Asses, Super Repel, Soothe Bell. Soothe Bell is Dece, uh, but not for what I need. So to Pop Thunderstone, Silk Scarf. Uh, Carbos, okay. Carbos, we'll give some speed to... Let's give some speed to Ivy League, I guess. Um, and then... We got an extra spot for whatever. Not from the link, but I recognize the name under my recommended. Nice. Well, welcome. Good to have you. Maybe they aren't around here. All right. Okay. What a weird thing. What a weird character, because in the main game, he's there to say, I lost an item. I lost glasses. Great. Um, and then you find black glasses, and he's like, oh, not those. See ya. <laughs> it's, 
It's the Meowth that we uh, killed in the first highlights. You guys remember the first highlights, how that ended? Yeah. Let's poison fang this fella. See ya. Well, he actually can't see it is the point. Nice. Oh my god. Apollo's playing? Yes, he is. He's he's works his hands raw and rough for the benefit of everyone. And, and I'm just going to come by later and just be like, Psh. I like how nobody has thought to do that also. <laughs> it's like, ah, this badge will let you use Rock Smash out of battle in the next town. Uh, but we haven't thought about using Rock Smash on the rocks we need to smash. He's done nothing for the benefit of no one. He's a failure, and he deserves to live in shame. Wheelie! Oh. He is riled up back there. He is in full riled up mode. You guys hear him? Woof to you too, Apollo. Uh, yeah, Nactagonus, uh, Rayquaza comes and just eats you. Uh, this is a new root, which means a new catch, and t -t 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 trainer battles. Um, I guess ground is different enough from steel rock that we could probably do this. Um, hopefully we can. Good luck to us. Hopefully they don't have just water types. Apparently Apollo likes uh, washcloths. He's getting real riled up by the washcloth. Uh, there's the water type that we didn't want to see. Okay. All right. Uh, I guess we got to switch out our boy here for our or our girl here for our boy here. Um, what's your what's your special defense looking like, Swagrat? You've got uh, 56 HP, 28 special defense. I think we got to switch you to. Unfortunately, for our boy Ivy League, not my best start to a battle. I'll tell you that much. Um, let's hope they don't both use physical attacks on Corbin 21, because I will be upset about it if they do. That's a great thing to see. It's a very good thing to see. Um, and very good also that I swapped, because it would have been neutral on what's-his-face. That's fine. It'll do okay damage, but it won't, like... Okay. Uh... Cut up that hunt tail real quick. Uh, I think maybe we can never switch into uh, our our boy Murkrow. I think he's a he's a start battle or don't battle type friend. Look at that! Five people on the team getting. Switch to, uh... Ooh, I can't switch to any of those. I'm gonna go ahead instead and just go ahead and just, uh, super potion our boy Ivysaur here. I'm not taking a risk with a crit fire blast. He will survive a crit fire blast now. Um... around bay leaves. Uh, 100 bits. Thank you, Coil Twitch bot. Yeah, I got a good look at your Pokemon, bud. 
Yeah, I agree that was too much excitement. If, if Ivy League dies, Phil is illegally obligated to catch a Venusaur. Man! What's the original mo fire move that Fire Blast replaces? Um, it doesn't, it doesn't directly replace moves that way. Um, it's just like, it, it randomizes the moves and then it's just more likely to be, uh, a grass. Is this a new route from that one? No, okay. Okay, I'm gonna stop doing dub double battles because it seems like a recipe for potential catastrophe. <laughs> Ivy League suffered third degree burns and Nurse Joy's like, you're tired. Squirtle, of course, of course. Dude, Squirtle's very cute, especially like in the early games before you like really knew what was going on with Pokemon send out a Squirtle, it's like, oh my god, he's a little guy. He's like a little man, but he's a turtle. Alright. Leaf blade him up. Yeah, a lot of Pokemon had Hyper Beam instead of Tackle, yeah. It could be that it... it uh, that's how the randomization works, uh, but that doesn't mean that a fire move that that uh, Bayleaf would have learned a fire move. Um, what's this one? This is just the the daycare or something. This is like I forget what this area is. A cradley, which is a uh, grass rock, so we can't really afford to take the fight because cradley has pretty good stats. Uh, we'll switch over to boombox and use a fighting move. The third dimension really hit Squirtle hard, huh? Alright. Well, we should be fine with this. Even if you get a powered up rage, I'll be able to kill you next turn. Oh no, not false swipe. That's the elite four in the house ahead. Oh right, right, right. You have to battle four people the family. I forgot about that. It's the family. A max ether, great. The wind straight family. Our family's hearts need as one. Okay, some more rocks to gate us there. And then Trainer Hill. Scale the heights, you hot blooded trainers. Trainer Hill is also emerald specific, right? The win straight family. Yeah, four matches straight, yeah. Is it Steven's family? I didn't realize it was Steven's family. Yeah. Win straight. The kill streak family. Um, yeah, what is the highest level with the family? The thing is, as long as it's not like a lot of white water and fire, I should be able to like switch into stuff. Killstreak family sounds like some sort of cursed gamer mafia and I hate that. It does, it does sound like that. Level 18 is their highest? Oh, okay. We should be fine, because it'll actually be like 20, 19 or 20, with our version. Yeah. That's the spirit. I like you. I'm throwing my Pokeball now. Win straight Victor would like to battle. Sent out Weedle. Do I want to catch in this water or not? Nah? It's a good question. One down. One level up. Level 20, baby. 
Two attack this level. Nice job, Sandikin. I'm proud of you. Okay. Slowking! Okay, our first water type. Um, luckily we can... Ooh, he's part psychic, isn't he? Okay. Good thing he didn't use psychic and crit baby big. Yeah, Slow King's kind of... Okay. Not bad damage from this level 17 Slow King to Ivy League. And a berry? This guy is just the goat, dude. All right, win straight victor. You're supposed to be the easy one, too. Ooh, yikes. Have I made an error with the win straight family? I certainly hope I don't... Uh, wipe to the win straight family did. I don't know if I could uh, live down wiping to the win straight family. Found a pretty strong trainer. Ooh, I'm gonna sneeze, guys, and see if I can mute my mic. <coughs> Not quite in time. Got it for the second one. My turn to battle now. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I've taken to saying Gesundheit. I'm working on actually doing it. Primeape, okay. Thing about Primeape is uh, the one good stat that uh, Tandakin has is defense, 40. Um, solid HP, should be able to survive a fighting move, which should be not very effective, right? Fighting against ground, uh, fighting against ground is normal. Um, can't switch to Agron. Can't switch to Murkrow. Uh, I don't expect a powerful grass or water move, and even if so, he has bad special attack, so I'm not too worried about that. Um, charm! It's a weird one. Uh, it's going to be hard for me to kind of effectively deal with him with low attack, but his speed's lower now. Uh, which means we can go for the... Oh, wow. Mach Punch. Okay. 11 damage from Mach Punch. It's a 40 power move. Um, let's try again. Another charm. Let's get a bad poison, Sandikin. Let's get a bad poison, Sandikin. Get a badly poison on this primate. There we go. Oh, not a badly poison. That is just bringing him to enough health to give him a berry, okay. Which means, uh, his... Okay, Ed Clamps can go because he's got bug typing as well. And hit him with a swift. Uh, Boombox could go, but would be hit by a super effective. Wow, we're a little weak to fighting too, huh? Ivy League might be the move. Corvid's not perfect here, Patriarch. Corvid's part dark. Uh, Ed Clamps is the move. Corvid has really, really bad defense, um, and, and I could easily see a neutral mock punch killing him. Um, let's go for the swift. Poison does resist fighting, um, but we need to make sure his HP stays reasonable. Uh, his speed is slow, so the only way he's going to go in front of Ed Clamps is another mock punch, which can only do 11 damage. A crit would be 22. We're okay. Good. Two more trainers. Perhaps I should have bought a super potion uh, before I came to the win straight family. <sighs> Halfway through. Win straight Vivi sent out Umbreon. That's okay. That's fine. Great Pokemon. Great family, honestly, of trainers. But that's okay. Can switch over to. Uh, Boombox, who has good HP, okay special defense, and a fighting move. And that should do well, plus it's a great Pokemon to have out after we take down the Umbreon.
they're very tasteful. They have great Pokemon. I'm very impressed with their Pokemon. It feels almost like this could be just like, okay, not, not anymore. But it feels like the Pokemon they could have, honestly. Uh, try attack should take down the Bulbasaur. Silk Scarf, stab bonus, try attack. Boom. Boom. Get out of here. And then finally, a Pupitar, who is rock ground, I believe. Karate Chop should do the trick. Okay. Phil loves killing Bulbasaur. Hey! Hey! Stop that. Um, take him down. All right, one more trainer, folks. The final trainer, the final countdown. Are legendaries a possibility for NPC to have? Yes, but not in the wild. Oh boy, how dare you make my granddaughter cry. For that, I'm going to smack you. Prepare to lose. I forgot for that I'm going to smack you. This lady comes out, it's like, I see a, a friggin' child, and I'm gonna smack him with my ponyta. If Sandikin, mm, yeah, we can take it. It's fine, you're fine. Quick Claw's gone. Mud shot successful. Should be good. Ooh, uh, 1 HP. Okay. I was a little worried there that, like, a really strong fire attack, like a fire blast situation might have been lethal. Um, but I took the risk. Wow, zero... <laughs> Zero special defense. Great work, Sandikin. Great work, bud. Visit with us a while. Um, I'm gonna go heal first real quick, bud. Absolutely, Sandikin's gonna evolve next level. We're gonna stop the evolution once, because at level 23, Sandik Sandikin will learn a move, and then we can evolve him that same level, and then we get another move at 24. You don't trust the lady who threatened to smack you just now? Weirdly, weirdly when the woman who threatened to smack me when I defeat her in combat and then she invites me into her home, um, I'm, I'm a little trepidatious. First trainer I've deployed, seen who deploys Pokemon so masterfully, my son is stronger than you. Okay. You'd end up crying in frustration. Knowing my grandson, he could be the champion already. Macho Brace. Too bad, the bag is full. Right. Forgot about the Macho Brace, dude. A hold item that increases the special attack of Clam Pearl. Um, it's also the hold item that allows him to evolve into Huntail. Um, however, what we're going to do with that is we're going to sell it. And then we're going to battle the gym, folks. That's right. We're battling Jim Halpert. All right. Let's go here. A hundred dollars. Great. Uh, let's sell... Got any revives? No. Uh, white flute. I don't really need a white flute. Battling Jim Gaffigan. What if you get a clam pearl later? True, I could put stuff in the box as well, but... Yeah, I'm gonna put some... a couple things in the box. I'm gonna put, like, the heart scale and the... We're gonna be so sad when we catch a count. Well, you can't... We, I can't trade, so, like... There's no way for me to get the Huntail, anyway. Cool trainer Vito in Victory Road, who's canonically the fifth win straight. Gotcha. Yeah, I vaguely remember that. I vaguely remember a, like... win straight somewhere else.
Okay, water stone goes away as well. All right. Oh, it's thunderstone. Have any other evolution stuff? Let's put the charcoal away for now. All right. Wait, do I have mail? I feel I feel like maybe someone sent me mail. Okay. Hey, didn't I kill your whole family's beloved Pokemon last week? Bum, 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 bum. It'd be cooler if they weren't actually delusional and the son slash grandson was the champion. That'd be cool. If he just like, his name is actually Steven Winstraight. Give Ed Clamps the metal coat just because it's cool. That's a good pitch. I'm gonna say no, but it's a good pitch. With my charm and my Pokemon's moves, you'll be shocked. Shocked, I say. Two, two, two Pokemon. First one's an Umbreon. I think uh, Corvid's the next one to go, to be honest. Not being able to switch into him kind of stinks. Again, Karate Chop is actually uh, weaker than a uh, stat boosted Tri Attack. Uh, so we're going to go for the Tri Attack there. Karate Chop would be useful if our stats were lowered because apparently crits avoid. Uh, hey! Okay, now it's only very slightly uh, weaker, so we'll go, go to it. Uh, yes, brown bearded one, I believe you were, is what someone said. Had to request a $500 advance so I could watch. Welcome, welcome. Thanks for sending me $500 to watch the stream. Another slow king. Man, these folks love them. They're, they're slow kings. Boomboxes, uh, definitely are, are, uh, like, reliable Pokemon here. I, I gotta tell you, I'm very happy to be able to use Nyxploud as, like, a reliable Pokemon. Um, I always in the game saw the Explouds, and I was like, that's a cool model, uh, but the Pokemon's not that great. <laughs> and I'm very glad uh, uh, th that I can. Uh, I failed you, Phil. Please be merciful. I forgive you. I forgive you. Bum, bum, bum. I guess I haven't done Cycling Road either. Is Cycling Road at my level right now? Should I be doing that instead of the gym? Or should I do the gym and then go on Cycling Road? This Slow King looks like Mussolini. I forgive you, but my Tommy Gun does. <laughs> meant to use it to pick up mail to get coin case. That makes sense. Okay. <sighs> I see reminders everywhere, folks. Uh, switch over again to Boombox. Boombox, Boombox. Boombox, Boombox. Uh, try attack. Burned him. Excellent. Because now if he uses reversal, which is kind of what I was af afraid of, uh, it won't do as much damage. Yeah, first extra effect on try attack of all time. That's true. We've been using that move a lot, and that's the first time we got it. I get that it's low. It's only 10% total, right? But still. Try attack? Don't mind if I do. What's up, Joker? But not as low as we've been getting. Oh, well, no odds are as low as we've been getting on this run. <laughs> Hell yeah, Joker. You 
replay some of the old ones. Dog in background. If you keep an eye, sharp eye, you can see the dog. Uh, okay, so I guess we're supposed to go to the cycling road now. This is this is way too open of a town. I do think they biffed it a little bit with the uh, design on this town. Nice, nice. Pokemon Yellow was my first game. Is this like the other one where you just fall? No. Hello. How do you like the way my raven-colored hair streams behind me? Great, dude. I, I don't... What? Okay. Dope, dope. The triathlon is hard in the extreme. You have to complete the three events of swimming, cycling, and running. Nice little educational lesson there, as opposed to a non-educational lesson. Uh, ask people the same thing all the time. Yeah, everybody's always asking people how how they like uh, the way my raven-colored hair streams behind me. Dude, I'm freaking streaming my raven-colored hair, am I right? On this version, it's got to be Rayquaza, Joker. It's got to be Rayquaza. All right, we're going to cancel this evolution. Actually, it might be Kyogre. It's probably Kyogre. I know, I know I'm just answering. Oh, the strongest one. But uh, Kyogre is... I love Kyogre. No, you're not. No, you're not. No, you're not. You're not evolving. No, no, no. I'm hitting B. I'm hitting B. Okay. Jeez. I was panicking, dude. I was Pandakin about Sandakin. Can you keep up with my speed? Uh, he learns a move at level 23, Zed, and then he learns another move if he's evolved at level 24. So I can get two moves for the price of one. This is one of the few times that we can indeed switch to Corvid at 21, who is Corvid level 22. Um, Tangela is poison as well. Oh, Tangela's pure grass. I've made an error. I've made an error. Sometimes you make an error around these parts. Hey, Corvid for Spiro. What a battle. Let's take it. Uh, Cross Chop will be the strongest here, even though it's neutral. All right. You get your friggin' fake out in, Spiro. Great. Corvid is going to chop you with his wings here. Uh, does Murkrow have a hat, or is that part of its body? That's part of its body that looks exactly like a hat. Yeah, it could be tough, Joker. Um, the moves are random, so it's uh, it's kind of tough. Let's take a look at Corvid's hat. Yeah, it's it looks like a hat. It is not a hat. I agree that socks are cool, by the way. Thanks for following. What's up, Spice Slicer? All right, so we just got to get one more level for Sandikin. What, what kind of HP are we looking at for him? 17 down. Let's use a potion on him. Let's be nice. Be careful during this bike path for a woman holding a sign. What? What did I, what joke did I miss there? Miss Drevis! A woman with a sign made 80% of the Tour de France bikers crash? Oh my god! Uh, Mistrevis, I do believe, has le Levitate. Poison Fang's not very, very effective, I think, but... Uh, let's see how we do in this fight. Yeah, it'll be a slow fight, but... Oh, we're the exact same speed, I see. We both can make each other flinch. So who goes first actually matters a lot. It's a Lick. Poison Fang. Get a Poison. What's up, Freeman? No! Okay. 
NBC Sports Channel. All right, all right. One more and we got him. There we go. Not the smoothest uh, kill here, but we did indeed get the mystery bus. How much of the game have you missed? If you hit exclamation mark highlights, you'll get the first two streams and uh, the highlights for the third stream will be indeed live soon. Um, Subscription. Leon, welcome back, bud. Damn, 15 months? This pandemic shit crazy. <laughs> you know? Welcome back, bud. How's, uh, did you finish Dark Souls 2? I've been, like, super distracted this past week, obviously. No 15 months on? That is Cap. I'll, I'll get to him. I'll get to, I'll get to 13 to 24. We've got 24 already, so I'll get to 13 to 23. Um... We're on our way. We're on our way. You did? So now you're on to three? Is that starting tomorrow? Or are you doing something else in the meantime? Alright, Alex Hoy. See you around, bud. Just under 600 deaths total. That's a good war. I mean, not a good war, but... Dude, he put his name on it... 45 times? He put 45 of his name on there? That's wild. That's obnoxious. Bloodborne next week. Nice. Are, are you like out of town on vacation? They did. I love the sprites in this game. Tauros, dude. Oh my god. Speaking of sprites that I love. What am I, at McDonald's right now? Because I freaking love this sprite. Am I right, folks? Uh, okay, so we're, let's hit, hit him with a dang mud shot. Excellent colors and pixel art. Yeah, I agree. Thank you, Upstruence. You're right, Phil. Thank you. Welcome back, Tab. Thanks for playing the tier two sub alert, which I uh, both am glad I made and also hate hearing a little of both. It's like a little of both. Uh, it's supposed to sound a little bad, but it sounds very bad. Um, it's also supposed to sound good, but like bad. It's supposed to, you know what I'm saying. Okay, uh, covers the user in mud. Let's go ahead and get rid of the covering the user in mud move. <laughs> Can't say that I want to cover uh, the user in mud. Um, Charizard. So Charizard will probably use a flying move into Sandakin rather than a fire move. Uh, Charizard's one of the Pokemon that I fear um, on account of our Pokemon not being very good against him. I could switch to Swagron and... Uh, It'll only be neutrally effective against Swagron. Um, however, special attack is very good against Swagron. I could switch to Boombox because Boombox is the goat. Uh, typically, Sandakin would be great against a fire type. However, uh, Charizard is flying. Um, Swagron, um, how is covering yourself in mud a move? I can do that. And you'd be very good against Pikachu if you did. Uh, I could do Swagron or Boombox. That's a choice. Uh, Swagron's only level 18. I'm gonna just play it safe with Boombox. Boombox is already level 27. Um... Dizzy Punch, dude! Corvid21 is a, a fantastic name, isn't it, Tab? Gives you a chuckle every time. It's also, like, timely, which is nice. It's just good stuff. I mean, obviously, nobody would be making that joke if it wasn't timely. Uh, Pichu is the final one. 
Uh, what? Why is there a level six Pichu? What happened here? Did I break the game? Why, why does he have a level six all of a sudden? Okay, the level six paralyzed my level 27. Good Lord. That's not part of his team, that's his pet. We will let this one happen, folks, right? Because he just got... Folks, Sandikin is now... Earth Vader. Sandikin is now Earth Vader, dude. Oh, the big, the big bump in stats. Frickin' 56, 57. Actually has more attack than the uh, Aggron, who's five levels lower now. So now it's his turn to train on the rest of this. I want this music to play at my funeral. You know, at my funeral, I don't want it to be some sort of mourning thing. I want people people to celebrate my life to the tune of the cycling road music from Pokemon Emerald. <laughs> I guess the Route 110 music. Uh, they don't make games like this anymore. The the they really don't. Um, they put their time into other pursuits, and I, I feel like. I, I really, I mean, pixel art rules, and, and look who I'm talking to. Um, it just rules, it just rules. Uh, just training so far in Lumport. So we, we started the gym, and then I was like, wait, is Cycling Road supposed to be used to train for the gym? People said yes, so uh, we're clearing out Cycling Road, grabbing the Harbor Mail uh, as soon as I can get around this corner. As soon as I am skilled enough to do that, and then we are gonna um, fight the gym, and then we'll probably be able to continue. Like it's only 2:30 right now, so we'll probably be able to continue on and do maybe do a second gym today or something like that. I don't know. I might be getting getting ahead of myself a little bit there. The fact that the world isn't completely fucked, uh, fucking coded in ghost types, implies there is definitely an afterlife. That's nice that in the Pokemon world there is an afterlife. Dude, there, like, I thought that, like, because, like, the original description for Gengar, what, levels, what is with the level sixes? Uh, the original description for Gengar was something like, uh, he'll kill ya. <laughs> it was, I, I forget exactly what it was, but the, the Pokedex entry was like, Gengar, this Pokemon will kill you. Um, and then, so... I thought that was like just like the first uh, generation or whatever. This is wild. Uh, but it's actually like in, even in the most recent one, um, there was like one that's like this Pokemon is the spirit of a child that got trapped in a forest or something. Um, what's up, Josen? Happy belated birthday. Um, great training with all these level six guys. Yeah, the, the experience is... At least I'm getting some effort values, am I right? Whoa, my brakes failed. Phantump, yeah. Just like... Dude, friggin' pop a wheelie. Get some jumps in. Right, 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 right. If you do a perfect run through with the... Uh, with a mock bike, you get something, right? How many cyclists have fallen off this bridge? One, actually, Shahan. We, we we ran by that one who's just like still on her bike. She's like, oh, I just fell off cycling road. I'm like, are you, did you get concussed? Cause it's really high up there. Th that's easily 30 feet. Are we gonna do contests? I suppose we could. If I lose a contest, I have to kill the Pokemon. All right, a harbor mail, harbor mail. Who sell? Oh my god! Okay. 
Love to buy good stuff in secrecy. Uh, excellent. I love to have fresh seaweed that... Do you sell it, or is it the shop? Guess it's just the shop. I'm the energy guru. Uh, does an emerald have something different? It does invert in turf. Uh, are enemies also sent to hell? Of course they're sent to hell. Of course. I am on a murder spree, for sure. Uh, that's my job. My job is to kill trainers Pokemon. Uh, let's get another 10 of those, and then let's get 10 Great Balls as well. And Super Potions. Uh, let's get 10 more Great Balls. 10 more Great Balls. And 10 more Great Balls. The only Pokemon that not sent to hell is Fineapple, who was a mistake. Unfortunately, Fineapple was caught on the same route as uh, Twin Peaks, and so we cannot use Fineapple, which is a shame, uh, but he's in the mistakes box. What's up, Zoe? Should you feel yourself... Uh, Attacked by a sudden chill, it is evidence of an approaching Gengar. There is no escaping it. Give up. Let's let's take a look at some entries here. Alright, nothing cool there. Okay, I don't care about the ones I don't know anything about, dude. Okay, let's take a look at uh, Beedrill. I guess you should only look at the ones that we evolved because we know we already read the other ones. Sand Slashes is uh, curls up in a ball to protect itself from enemy attacks. Also curls up to prevent heat stroke. What a lame entry. <laughs> Your Pokemon is a what kind of Pokemon? What kind of Pokemon is Sand Slash? You're calling this motherfucker a mouse? All right, it's a hedgehog or an armadillo or one of a million things. He's not a mouse, dude. Ariados, we already looked at. I don't think we involved anybody else, right? Everybody else is. Yeah, we're good, we're good. Poor Electric. I guess a shrew is a mouse. Yeah, I guess. Pokedex entries are either David Attenborough narrates the life of mortal beast or top 10 scariest anomalies on earth that will kill you type stuff. No in between. It's like, Pichu likes to eat out of a person's hand. <laughs> He'll be your best friend forever. Haunter wants to commit murder and has. Miss Drevis used to be the Pied Piper. Grass is not very effective against steel, right? And as such... I'm gonna do this. Steel wing, baby! Get those steel wings in there. Ah, not quite. Metal Claw! Impressive. Mortal Kombat voice, impressive. Doesn't the Abra Evolution line also have something to do with possessing children? I'm sure. I th the Abra Evolution line is like, uh, Elikazam is smarter than a supercomputer, I believe. It's like the original one. Tropius. Uh, go ahead. Ancient power of that Tropius should be a lethal attack. Goodbye, Trop. Oh. Tropius is kind of bulky, huh? 
it's going to be a, a lethal attack, double quick claw, baby, or Tropius is very slow. 3,000 IQ, yeah. And you're just like a child being like, go! <laughs> He's like, I battle for this child because it is the greatest joy in the universe. Service. Wiggly Tough regu regularly extorts other Pokemon in Mystery Dungeon. Is Mystery Dungeon canon? It's like an Oblivion Mages Guild level prank. Metagross is the one that's contained to compared to a supercomputer. Gotcha. I'm pretty sure that like in the original like because I had the Pokemon Handbook, uh, the 150 as a kid. I had that. Anybody else have that? And uh, I think it said something about supercomputer. Yeah, smart character has seven PhDs. That's it. like yeah, classic. Like person spent a long time uh, getting PhDs. That's what that is. Um, head clamps is 19, uh, Corvid 21 is 22. Uh, maybe Ivy League and Swagron? So Swagron gets a little stronger. Oh, I should have done the double battle. What am I doing? The whole point of me checking that was the double battle. Bug Maniac Angelo sent out Gligar, ground flying type. Ground is four times effective, but Swagron's defense is such an incredible stat that I feel safe. Should I feel safe? Oh, easy. Easy. He uses Dig. And then we go switch to our man Corvid. A perfect time to switch. You're absolutely right about Alakazam. Its brain cannot perform a supercomputer. Its intelligent quotient is said to be 5,000. Uh... Get a nice gust in there. Won't do too much, but Corvid does have good attack, so... Okay, yeah, don't worry about that. But uh, have a little bit of a heart attack there. Just a tiny bit of a heart attack for a second. And kill him. He used Fisher there, which if it, if it affected him and could hit him, would kill him. Team is pretty wild, though. I think they'll do good. I hope so, yeah. The team is... I mean, the team is cool. At the very least, it's a cool team. Oh, yes, dude. What luck. What luck I've found. Can Alakazam run Crisis? Silver Wind will be neutral. Dude, Alakazam can run Crisis and play Crisis, and then also just, like, open Gimp in three different windows and uh, export and... Uh, export a video. I'm trying to think of the render a cartoon is what I was trying to do with the joke, uh, and I was trying to find funnier words for everything, but I went with export a video. Probably not the best punchline. I could do better, and I, I uh, resolve to in the future. Uh, let's get on over to the PC, aka the Pokemon Center. Can't believe Crisis ran so badly for so long just because they hardwired it to use a suit. What? That's so funny. I have Insomniac, yes. I like it sometimes. Depends on, like, uh, how it's being used. I don't, I don't think I really drink it straight. Um, but I've had it in a lot of cocktails, and it, it can be very, very nice in a cocktail. Um, I've had it straight, but I, I don't know if it's for me straight. Pokemon just canonically love blood sports, and the Pokemon God created humans for the purpose of making more fighting opportunities. <laughs> is that is that canonically true? Is that what uh, like Arceus, Ar Arceus? Is it Arceus or Arceus? Forget Noah's Arceus. Oh, get out of here, Kakuna! I'm not even gonna honor you with an ancient power. Oh, I meant to do Rock Throw, not Steel Wing. That's all right. Nothing bad's going to happen here. How many Pokemon are just confused children, like Machop and Abra? Uh, most. Most Pokemon are just confused children. Swagron? Definitely a confused child. 
Alright, I don't know if we can start with Swaggeron, though, against Lieutenant Surge 2.0. Good to know that that's all I have to do in order to go straight to the end. Critical hit, 5 damage, yeah. That's why I love Pokemon, because I'm also a confused child. What is the odds that Quick Claw lets you go first? Arceus. That's funny. That's very funny, Lodestar. I didn't know that. Uh, guys. I don't know, I'm saving. Are you ready? Are you ready to hear wah-ha-ha-ha? We got the wah ha 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 guys. The wah ha ha ha. Ugh. Do I remember the wah ha 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 or what? Machoke directly into my frickin' uh, level 19 Swagron. Double super effective. Uh, I can go to Sandikin, or I could go to, uh, I think the move is going to uh, Ivy League here. That man is clearly a Magikarp on top of a sweater. Okay, Vital Throw always hits, but it's not going to be super strong here. Um, we're just going to go ahead and Spore him. Are we underleveled? I hope not. Wow. Less damage than I would have thought, but luckily, <laughs> cats. Uh, I think he uses a potion here, so yeah. That's good, that's good. Um, we want him using potions on the Pokemon that are not as good. Got the crit anyway, baby. Okay, Swaggeron leveled up, excellent. Another three attack, another four defense. Ivy League leveled up. Another two defense, two special defense, I'll take it. Surskit, we've seen three Surskits today already. Uh, let's switch. We're going to Corvid. That's so funny, Lodestar. I didn't even realize that was like, Dude, he's got a competitive set. This dude has a set. Corvid. Buddy. You're already on, like, thin ice with us. You can't be missing attacks. I'm not scared of the water bug. I'm just... He set up a Reflect for his team. So only two turns of Reflect left, but there will be two turns of Reflect here. Get it, Dunk. What do you think? Do you think do you think that this sprite might be a good Pokemon? That's as I think that's his highest level. So we go to Ivy League and we just hope use water gun. So it can please use water gun. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you for using water gun. Okay. Pose reflect war off. In grain, yes, dude. <laughs> he 
Yeah, don't mind Phil Dunk. He's stressed right now. I am stressed because he's he's a tank, and he just used ingrain. I thought maybe we could just two hit him here. If we crit, we kill him. If we don't, we have to hit one more. He'll get two attacks off either way. So I think Spore is the move here. Payday! Okay, I think we have to heal after we use Spore. Do I gotta put the no back seating on? Do I gotta do it? Don't make me do it. Don't make me put the tag on. Don't make, make me tap the sign, dude. Okay. We bought 10 super potions just for a situation like this. Do you get extra money if the op oh, opponent uses payday? You don't. I don't think. Watch it, Insomniac. Watch it. <laughs> Dude, Suicune so absorbed nutrients with its roots. Come on, buddy. So if you win, then you don't lose. Oh. Oh. What? This dude is just restoring his health. Th this guy has a competitive set, dude. No! Stop this nonsense, Watson. I'm gonna run out of leaf blades. He's doing a PP stall set, dude. He has a straight up PP stall. Only two leaf blades left. Okay, we got the crit, guys. So we took down what we expect to be the toughest Pokemon on Watson's team. And we're left with a tor Torchic. Okay, we could we can handle a Torchic. Uh, we could probably Bone Club it, but I'm gonna let uh, Sandkin have his time to shine here. Oh man, yeah, the spore the spore went big there. The spore went huge, and that's that's why we love uh, Ivy League so much. Step forth, Earth Vader. I guess the name Raider is in uh, the town below. Do we want to go and rename him Earth Vader? Was it, was that what we agreed when we when he was uh, being being trained? It has to be all one word, Earth Vader. Oh right, it makes your Pokemon faster. I forgot about that. In these games, like, does it contain rollout? You can count on it. Yeah, it does contain rollout because it contains shockwave typically. Yeah. Only if everybody agrees on it. Looks like Earth Vader is agreed on. We were training when we were training him outside of uh, like the forest. We were discussing. We were trying to think of what he evolves into, and I think we agreed on Earth Vader. one letter in the alphabet from the original name and it makes a lot of sense given that the initial name of the Pokemon was Sandikin. All right. Come forth, Earth Vader. Yo, remember when Watson said wahahaha? That's the turn that always got me when I was doing the mock bike turns. I'm just going to claim I was the first to make the pun in the second stream. Bill hasn't hopped on his bike in a long time. You're true. That, you're, you're true. There you go. That's not it. This is it. Hell 
yeah. Name Raider, yes. Uh, Sandikin. Quite a fine name, but what if I were to suggest a slightly better name? Ah, good. Then what should the new nickname be? He's like, I would, I would love to suggest a better name. Uh, what would I suggest to you? Earth Vader. <laughs> From now on, this Pokemon shall be known as Earth Vader. It's a better name than before. How fortunate! Wait, is this the battle tent? Oh, it is the battle tent. He's too dangerous to be left alive. He must stand trial. I couldn't tell you, Tab. Um, I have a dumb voice. <laughs> Alright, let's move over here. This is the strip that you can ride with your mock bike to hatch eggs very quickly. Just right there. Anybody's wondering. Alright, um, who's learning Rock Smash? I think it's one of the ones we actually have to know. Wait, is the new, is the move deleter in this town? Wally's house. Where is the move deleter? Does anybody know? I keep I keep asking and I keep forgetting. Is ages? You're absolutely right, Ooch. Lily Cove is the move leader. Damn. All right. It's gonna be a while. So we gotta teach someone Rock Smash. Let's first see who can learn it. Uh, everybody can learn it, that's right. It's a horrible move. Uh, probably Earth Vader, right? Instead of, uh, he would be able to learn Rock Smash anyway, I believe. Uh, we can get rid of Sand Tomb. We could get rid of, uh, definitely not Ivy League. Ivy League's moveset is sick. It's gotta be Earth Vader. Instead of Sand Tomb. I guess it could be Corvid too. Corvid bug move. Rock Smash is so bad in this game. 20 attack. I think you need it, right, Violet Dark Kitty? Because you have to go north of town. You, you need it, like, all the time. Uh, Mudshot lowers speed, cats. I'm gonna get rid of, uh... Yeah, I thought, it, I, I thought as a kid it was, uh... A rock move, too. Just because it says rock. Like, rock throw, rock smash, of course. Uh... But, uh, I learned... I'm never gonna use Sand Tomb. I'm getting rid of Sand Tomb. Rock Smash being this week makes that guy who struggled to break one stone since the start of the game funnier. It does. It really does. It makes it a lot funnier. Also that they call it Rock Crushingly Strong. I wonder if it will even kill this level 6 Meowth. I'm glad. 
Uh, Earth Vader's sprite is so sick. I love it. It reminds me of the opening cinematic. Ding. Wow, you shattered that boulder blocking the way. To show you how much I appreciate it, I'd like you to have this HM. Strength. Excellent. Wanda, now I can see you anytime. That's wonderful. Please, take some rest at my home. I always found it weird that she was like, that's dot, 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 wonderful. What was she about to say? What, why is she coming out to this cave every day? If she doesn't want him to see her, you know? Earth Vader, baby. Now that Earth Vader's a little faster due to evolution, we're going to go ahead and give Earth Vader the soft sand instead of the quick claw. We're also going to go use that harbor mail to write someone a letter. Just kidding. We're going to go trade the hard harbor mail for... Uh, coin case? Oh, you have harbor mail? Will you trade it for a coin case? Well, oh, I'm so happy that this 50 uh, pokey dollar item was traded for my completely unfindable item. What a good trade. Song slaps. Yep. A torchic doll, yay. Thanks for the coins, bud. This has coins in it. Damn. Gotta dig through the trash if you're in a Pokemon game, dude. Train your children to leave home and dig through the trash in casinos. Check the TMs. They look great. Maybe with a little bit more money. Folks, I'm going to be right back. I'm going to play y'all an advertisement via the Twitch module. Um, and I'm going to play you the video that I uploaded this week. Hope you enjoy it. Have a lovely time. Welcome to the Adventurer's Goods and Wares. How can I help you? Oh, yeah, I'm looking for uh, healing tinctures. Tinctures? Of course. Top shelf there. Let me grab a ladder. Oh, yeah, it's no problem. Oh, it's pretty high. I don't think you can... How much? Did you just fly? What? No. Oh. Okay. I think I'm going insane. Oh, do you mean my double jump? Wow. I am going insane. Yeah, I can do a front flip in the air and that propels me upwards, can't you? Well, I guess I've never tried. You should try it. All right. I guess I'll give it a shot. We are gathered here to mourn the shopkeeper. 
He tried to reach a second level platform, but he died as he lived, level one. You can always count on him to have precisely 500 gold. I stole from him every day. All right, let's get that friggin' dangin' music playing again, dude. Oblivion moment. Love being able to steal 500 gold every day. The video that I just played. What's conditioned again? Ah, right. This is, uh, how beautiful they are. The running animation is unnecessarily <laughs> hectic. Yeah, that's how hot your Pokemon is. Hold on, I need to listen to that music. Beautiful. All right. Um, wait, what does that do, by the way? Rock smashing that? I guess I, could, I, I get the strength TM, Phil. What are you talking about? I got it already. Oh. It's a show on, though. The Name Raider Show, folks. Earth Vader. Nickname is a nickname fit for a unique individual of Pokemon. If it remains properly, its uniqueness will bloom excessively. The flow from the initial letter E to A is especially wonderful. He's like, dude, that's a great parody right there. Does he ever say the nickname sucks? Yeah. Uh, he says if you want to change a nickname of a traded Pokemon, he's like, this is the perfect nickname. Bye. That's their mechanism by which they say you can't change names. It's a pretty funny one, actually. So we could catch here, but I think, I think uh, not, honestly. I just think not. On account of... Oh, you ready to get an interview, dude? Let's get Ed Clamps and Earth Vader into this fight here. A tough looking trainer here, of all places. The TV guy, the cameraman, is named Ty. <laughs> kind of like close to like TV. Uh, and then Gabby who is an interviewer, she might talk a lot. <laughs> Gabby and Ty, guys. Togepi and Fortress. So we're gonna go ahead and mud shot the old uh, Fortress. We're also going to sky uppercut the Togepi. Fortress used extreme speed. It's TF2, dude. We had a, uh, a Fortress named TF2 in our last playthrough. Ed Clamps used Sky Uppercut, dude. The scissor just Sky Uppercutted a Togepi. And that Togepi is dead. Has been slain. And now, so will the fortress be dead. 
probably. As long as Ed Clamps doesn't miss a Sky Uppercut. All these balls for Ed to punt. Ed balls, dude. Awesome, awesome. Who are you? Sure. Feelings about the battle? Nah, that's boring. Let's find a funny thing. Awful. <laughs> this will make a great TV show, dude. That's going to be a... Th th they're selling a great TV show there. You want a good TV show, dude? Um... This Pokemon is a psychic dragon. No, it's... <laughs> it's a dragon flying type. It's a dragon flying type. Final answer. Don't mess with me, Fulcane. Twenty-two crit. It's Dragon Psychic, I'm wrong. Alright, let's give our boy a potion. No! Okay, okay. Why did I not turn off game breaking moves, dude? I think I go to. I think I go to. I think I go to Boombox here. 105 HP. Dragon. See how much Dragon Breath does to Boombox. 34. How is it? Okay, he's used three moves. Two of them have been Dragon Breath, and both Dragon Breaths crit. I need to catch a break at some point, dude. Blow him up, dude. Blow him up. Okay, 54 HP. I'm faster than him. Finish him off, dude. Okay. Okay. Fine. These guys, these guys did. String shot. Oh, that was scary. Thank God I didn't go. Ah, he's only got dragon breath. I can I can use an attack with Agron because I almost did. He was at 40 HP. He was he was at 40 HP, and I was like, maybe I can use maybe I could use just a basic. Attack. I uh, can't talk about mods in the chat, Glenn, but if you're curious about that, you can hang out in the Discord and someone might be able to help you with something similar. Uh, Cavs, uh, we encountered a uh, what I like to call Latios, who uh, had Dragon Breath and Dragon Rage. Uh, but he did not kill anybody. Psychic Dragon. Uh, no legendaries showed up. I can't catch any legendaries in wild Pokemon. That's not possible. Um, nice, Steffi. Yeah, 
Well, it's impossible for me to not train my Pokemon, so. Oh, uh, the Sandstorm. I forgot about the Sandstorm, dude. You need, like, goggles to go through the Sandstorm. You remember that? Ah, the Pet Boy! We gotta kill a Pet Boy's Pokemon. Alright, um... That is true. That is true. Um, okay, so he's got Dragon Breath and Dragon Rage, I know. Um... I'm gonna smack him with a Silver Wind first. Still 49 HP, don't paralyze, and we're good. Good. Done. Done, dude. We're in Dragon City, baby. Get that stat raise. As if to say, you never had a shot, Dragonair. Not against Ed Clamps. This game's been too easy, right? Phil has a good team now. Four attack, baby. That's what we love to see. Four attack for Ed Clamps. Let me quickly retweet my... Uh, Stream notification. Okay, we've, uh... Yeah. I'm strong. I won't cry if I lose. Pretty low bar you've set for yourself there, Camper Larry. Uh... Ah! Okay. Um, good news is Silverwind is very good against him, and he used Pound, so, um, <laughs> okay, all right, Ed Clamps is the uh, Dragon Slayer, clearly, dude, these campers and their legendary dragons, dude. It's getting to be too much. It's getting to be simply too much. Oh, he, yeah, he, he cried. He definitely cried after I killed his Lacius. I... <laughs> Uh, another camper had another Lacius there, Cavs. I remember, uh, Spice, if you use an at symbol, it looks like both of their names, which is cool. It looks like both the A and the O. So that's neat. Um, okay. Uh, we're going to go up here, and we're going to fight another trainer. And this trainer, my guess is that this trainer is going to have a Deoxys. That's my guess. Let's fight this camper who has a Deoxys real quick. Simply have a Deoxys. Camper uh, Cindy sent out, camper Picnic or Carol sent out Tropius. Okay, we, get to, we can handle, handle a Tropius. Uh, I'm just, I'm, I'm going for the, the worst case scenarios out the gate, so. Now that we know that there's no Deoxys, a little bit better shape. Cute banana baby. Agreed, agreed, agreed. Grass Whistle. Tropius is a very cool, uh, Oh, nice lump core. We could have. Can't anymore, though. Spit up! A literally useless move. Well, actually, let me just make sure that's the one that I think it is. Um, if I remember correctly, spit up is the counterpart to swallow. Yes. And Machop. Machop, we have boosted stats, we can handle Machop. And we can handle Machop probably with a single Swift, but it might be two. 
Alright, nice, 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 nice. Head clamps, got a little experience. Uh, this game's gonna get a lot harder in like one gym-ish, because everything after level 35, I believe, is, is gonna be fully evolved. Okay, Route 112. This is a new route, folks, right? Which means we can catch a Pokemon. All right, here we go, folks. The only Pokemon we can catch on this route. Should we start actually with uh, Corvid for Super Fang? We should, right? Is the only Pokemon we can catch on this route is an Espeon. Let's go ahead and kill it. No, <laughs> Super Fang. Okay, this is epic. Super Fang once more, get him down to 25% health. And Super Fang a third time to get him down to 12.5% health. Wahahaha. Psych up. Fine. I'm afraid to switch to uh, Ivysaur because Ivysaur is part poison. Um, we do want to spore Espeon, but Corvid is dark type, so fully resists Espeon. And uh, we're probably going to catch him in like three great balls anyway, so no need to worry. All right, two down, two down. No worries, no worries. All right. No worries. We're going to catch him. We have too many uh, Pokeballs to not catch this Espeon. See, watch. Easy, dude. Easy, dude. Easy. An Espeon is extremely loyal to any trainer it considers to be worthy. It is said to have developed precognitive powers to protect its trainer from harm. Give a nickname? Yes. What is this Pokemon's nickname? Esport? Esper? Psst, 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 psst. Uh, <laughs> Prince? Lisp man, Esperanza. Is it lowercase too? Or or a standard like all uppercase, like every every other name? Has to be lower. Joaquin. I think is gonna win here. An Espeon named ps, 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 ps. <laughs> the John Bone Man going bum 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 It's also it's a very good nickname because obviously it's like what you do to cats to get cats to come to you, but also uh, it's the first two letters of psychic. So Let's take a look at our boy. Uh, level 15, 42 special attack, 38 speed. Uh, barrier, Psy Wave, Psy Beam, and Psych Up. So, uh, I mean, Barrier is potentially usable. Psy Wave is bad. Uh, 
Psybeam and Psych Up. It is definitely worth checking to see if uh, Espeon can learn Sacred Fire. However, we have to decide who to get rid of. And I believe we're getting rid of Murkrow, right? I mean, God, this team rules, dude. This team kind of rules. Um, and of course we are putting Murkrow, Corbett 21, in the nice zone. There's no... I can't imagine there's contention over that, right? So we have two Pokemon now in the nice zone. Um, oh my god, look at how much uh, Sprite jumps up and down. And how little it moves. Well-deserved nice zone. Um, okay, probably Bright Powder because we want him to avoid getting hit very much. We could also give a Quick Claw. We don't want a Quick Claw. I guess King's Rock could also work, right? What's up, Doofus? But the King's Rock is only physical, right? And it could also be Amulet Coin, but we're going to go Bright Powder for now. Yeah, I think it's just the tail that moves, I agree. You can give King's Rock to Scissor because Twin Needle does the flinch roll twice. The flinch roll twice, yeah, true. Dude, this MF said flinch. I don't know if I'm going to use it for that reason, especially when my speed's not amazing on Scissor, but I guess if I'm over-leveled, then it's okay. All right, bud. Time to learn Sacred Fire Espeon. I know you can do it. There's a move that is wickedly cool. It's called Sacred Fire. Ah, uh, not able to learn it. Stinks. Works for all moves, not just physical. It works in all ways, not, not just physical. In all respects, not just physical. I'm trying to remember the exact... Uh... Oh, yeah, good question, Fulcane. That's randomizer at work right there. Although I did have a uh, Fero that knew Flamethrower in Pokemon Crystal because of the move tutor. You gotta be careful catching. <laughs> yeah, dude, it's 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 a good Pokemon to have on our team. I'm pumped about it. Um, I do want to just quickly probably get him like two levels on the wild Pokemon down there in case I encounter like a. a Wobbuffet or something wild and ha and it's over leveled and I have to fight a, a shadow tag Pokemon. So let's go over here. Just level him up like twice. Uh, Grumpig Remix. When have you ever been cornered by an overly powerful Shadow Tag Pokemon in the Wobbuffet line this run? To a Pokemon you just caught. Under 52, not bad. A scissor. This is where we caught our scissor, of course. Our pss, 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 pss cannot kill a scissor, though. And instead, we will have to go to, let's say, let's say Earth Vader. Our ground attack here. It's nice to think about that every Pokemon you haven't encountered yet can be a self-destruct minefield. It's very nice to think about. I love to think about it. Uh, would I say ps -ps 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 is paper and Earth Vader is rock? Uh, would I say that? I'm not sure. I think I might. All right, Beachin. Thanks for coming by, bud. Bone Rush. 25, two to five times.
stronger than Mudshot on average. Uh, most of the time it'll be stronger than Mudshot. Uh, less accurate, only 80 accuracy, but potentially even stronger than Earthquake. Um, I think we do get rid of Sand Attack for that, because Sand Attack is pretty much only good with uh, uh, catching. That is true. I could also put uh, the King's Rock on uh, Earth Vader. What kind of speed are we looking at between Earth Vader and Ed Clamps? 42 versus 36. Uh, so four, three more levels. Uh, he almost definitely won't pass him. So let's take that. Give you King's Rock. Give Ed Clamps that quick claw get back. And unfortunately, Ps -ps -ps hasn't leveled up from that. But, should be able to with a single good bone rush here. Maybe not. Is Espeon hard to level up? Nice. I do like that Nice now pops up with a little picture of Apollo. Bone Rush! Bone Rush! Ow. Earth Vader, I gotta switch you because you might die to a crit here against a level 14. I'm disappointed, Earth. 25 steps to the Pokemon Center, I think. I think we're okay, but like, damn, dude. Very disappointing. Medium fast. Glad I switched, because that was a big crit. See a scissor. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 60. <laughs> That's funny, Cavs. Okay. Here we go. Espeon's about to level up. I'd be a bad route to train on, honestly. Can't kill the scissor. Man. Better, ba better. Great noise. Here's the move. You go Swagron, and then you go Rock. Cause like, good luck with that, buddy. Good luck with your physical attacks into Swagron. Out of here. Get out of here. Hey, Strawberry Bunny. Good to see you. Oh, it's yeah, that's right part steel, so it won't be super effective, but that's alright, that's alright. Smack him with a rock here. Caterpie! Level 13 Caterpie. Um, I do think we have to do a sink or swim fight with uh, Espeon on the 13 Caterpie. Good. I would have been pretty upset at Espeon if she did not beat... Or, sorry, he did not beat a level 13 Caterpie. I'll take Attract. Decent status effect. Decent status effect. Um, get rid of Psy Wave or Psych Up. Yeah, Psych Up. Bye. Cheers, Cavs. Have a sip of this coffee here. Espeon's Japanese name is Afi. Vaporeon's name is Showers. That's cute.
Da -da 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 -da. Oops, that moves there. Ba -da -ba -ba -da. Guys, that's that that Pokemon being sent out of the Pokeball sound slaps. Truly slaps. That one's decent, but really hits the spot. Jolteon's name is Thunders, Flareon's name is Booster. I like Booster and Showers. Thunders is a little weak. All of his attacks do one damage. Uh, Twin Needle does one damage twice, though. Seems like a bad area to train. Only 185 for the swap. 90 for killing a Caterpie. I think maybe I kill a couple more and then I just take my odds with Espeon. Like, it's a good Pokemon. I probably don't have to worry too much about encountering, like, a... I don't know. What, what would be the worst case here? Cheers, Devi. Lick a tongue, which in German is schlerp. That's funny. Alright, Altaria is part dragon, right? But we have 49 HP. You know, I'm not I'm not risking uh, I'm not risking it. I'm gonna go to uh, swag around again. <laughs> Flying dragon for real this time. Gust would have been fine. A crit! I think that crit did one damage. Bye. All right, 174 there. Not the worst. You wouldn't download a slurp. All right. Oh, I keep going to the lower right to expect Psybeam there. Did we have a Pokemon that had Psybeam in the lower right? What am I, uh... What am I remembering? Gotta be something. I'm not just, uh, out of my mind. All right, Scissor. Just a nice, uh, Pokemon named Scissor. throw first here. Throws a small rock at the enemy, if I remember correctly, is the description of that move. S Lady up with a scissor emote. Scissor is a very cool Pokemon. Cool, cool quotient. Very high on scissor, I gotta say. Definitely very high on scissor. Clampy hands. All right, where, where, which is the cool quotient higher on? Scissor or Aggron? Do I prefer Scissor over Scyther? Um, that's a tough question. Um, I think so. Yeah, I think so. I don't know. It's they're they're both like very cool. Um, Scissor is all the yeah, and it's also the only bug Pokemon we chose. And prob probably, in this generation, the only bug Pokemon we would choose. Yeah, Scissor is our uh, Lachias killer. All right, what's up, Hiker? My legs are solid from pounding up and down the mountains. They're not going to buckle easily, friend.
let's just battle, please. Let's not do whatever that was. Let's not have that discussion. Sir. Don't sleep on Ninjask. Eh. I don't know if I would use Ninjask. The double weakness to rock is pretty scary in a... Uh, in a run like this. Armaldo's from this gen. Oh, that's true. I, I would probably use Armaldo. We do, we do like Zinx. We do very much like Zinx. I wish uh, Espeon were still out. I don't think I could switch into Espeon. Just because Espeon's a little underleveled. So we'll, we'll go to Ed Clamps. <laughs> Vile Plume with low kick, dude. Bonk. I don't remember the trainer, the the gym leader in the next town's name, but I do remember that she has has in the original game a Torkoal, who is like good. Flannery, Flannery had that that good Torkoal. Agron or Tyranitar, yeah, that's a good. Uh, that's a good. Which one's better? Like, which one's cooler? Ah, oh, my legs have cramped up. Can you grab me some bandages from my backpack? No, that's my Pokenab. Oh, fine, I'll register you. I didn't like anything about the interaction with this guy. Gotta say, not a fan of that man. Sorry to that man. Uh, let's get a potion on him. I just don't feel like wasting the time. Ha 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 ha. This guy is a student of Watson, but he's hasn't figured it out yet. Sableye, Ghost Dark. We gotta go for Swagron, right? Both scary for ps 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 ps. Sableye is very cool. Thief! Is he gonna actually steal it? Okay, he can't. That would have been very rude. You merely adopted the Wahahahas. That's cool. He's a cool Pokemon. What's, it, what's his Pokedex entry? I bet his Pokedex entry is messed up. I'm just going out on a limb and saying that Sableye has something like lures children into caves and kills them or something like that. There's a Mega Sableye? I would never have guessed it. Probably a mouse Pokemon. Iron Tail! Wow, okay. Five gifted subs. Great. Except it's ten. Um, thank you very much, I am Shabs. Really appreciate it. Sorry that it played five. Uh, I guess I have to set it to exactly five. And I should also write a song for ten, huh? Maybe I'll be able to do that this week. Thank you very much. Appreciate it very much. I assume it's I am Shabs and not I am Shabs, right? Um, Iron Tail, guys. So here's a decision that we have to make. Iron Tail is 75% accuracy with 100 power. Steel Wing 70-90, I think that's better. Um, 70 times 90 is 6,300. Uh, 100 times 75 is 7,500. Uh, so technically Iron ta Tail ha does have a higher expected value. Um, 
Why keep stop it at zero coverage? Is that true? Um, like ground stomp is good against, uh, which is uh, Swaggeron's weakness. Grass, uh, water, right? Um, no, I guess not grass because steel steel uh, doesn't hit that. Um, I don't think I don't think we get rid of Steel Wing for Iron Tail. Seventy five is pretty low, um, and I don't think I'm gonna feel confident using Iron Tail despite the fact that it's a lot stronger. Um, and I do think that Stomp has some outside use cases, um, right? There are some places where you would want to use Stomp where you wouldn't want to use a uh, uh, Steeler Rock move, right? You'd be dumping Stomp, but I, I don't see myself using Iron Tail. 75%? Like, if, if I'm in a place where I need a powerful move, I'm probably... When are you going to need a normal attack? I just explained. Grass or, or whatever else. It's, it's, it's still 65. It's not horrible. I mean, 65, 100 is, is not horrible. I don't know. You're making me doubt myself now. I just don't see myself using Iron Tail. All right, fine, whatever. Whatever. I'll do it. Whatever. 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 <laughs> the only type to resist rock and steel is steel, which is also normal, also is, is resisted by steel. We need a meteorite to awaken that thing. Oh, I get it now. That's why the rest of the crew went out to Fall Arbor. Fall Arbor. Tree Fall? Fall Arbor? Very nice. You got it. And until they come back, we're not going to let anyone pass. Right. One of my favorite things about the Pokemon games is sometimes they use a gameplay gate like this one, where it's two rocks, and you can't smash the rock until you have a Pokemon that can smash the rock. And it, and a badge that allows you to use it. It's like, oh, okay, that makes sense. Uh, and then sometimes they have weak little men whose Pokemon suck, <laughs> who are just like, we aren't letting you buy. <laughs> just like a cowardly man. Let's head out. It's like, I get that like an adult can stop a child from getting to a place. Um, but also, this is the first Pokemon on this route. We can catch this Pokemon. I forgot entirely. I forgot entirely that you can encounter Pokemon out of rocks. This is the route where we refuse to fish. So we can actually catch this Pokemon. That rules, in my opinion. What doesn't rule quite as much is we don't have our Super Fanger. Um, feasibly, we need water. Um, at this point, though, uh, who we swap out is a little bit less clear. Um, I don't know if we can hurt him at all without, like, killing him, right? I've got some allergies acting up, guys. Very well balanced. Love that. I mean, we like our Sand Slash a lot, honestly. Um, Ed Clamps is killing it. That attack, 72. Are you kidding me with that? Uh, Boombox. Honestly, Boombox is our worst Pokemon right now, probably. But he does have 105 HP. I don't think we're switching out a uh, just a pure psychic type with amazing special attack. 
Yeah, and Boombox is a good catch-all. Like, normal type with a lot of HP and, like, not great defense, but, like, balanced defense is good. Um, and we're not... Pff, no shot we're getting rid of Agron. The amount of swag on this guy. Um... Feasibly... Feasibly, Rock Smash might not kill, but it's 40 power. Shar Sharpedo has really bad defense. Um, I guess feasibly, like... I could see Ivy League using Bone Club not killing. It's only 32.5 power. Low attack. I don't really know what um, the catch rate's like either. Right, right. Weak against water, so... Let's see. Let's see what a great ball. Full health. Asleep. Level 12. Doesn't look great. Doesn't look great. We'll see. Throw a couple and then we'll see what we do. Would a dive ball work here? I don't think so. Vice grip. Not a good move. Sharpedo. Interesting. Yes, Sharpedo is an interesting Pokemon. Yeah, the net ball is uh, bugs and water types. Sharpedo does have coverages that we don't have. But Dark and Water are special. And he has a lot of attack, right? The Vicious and Sly Gangster of the Sea. Its skin is specially textured to minimize drag and water. Its speed tops out at over 75 miles per hour. The Vicious and Sly Gangster of the Sea. Uh, there's there's zero uh, physical water moves in this game, full game. In fact, literally zero. Uh, Torpedo, Sharky McSharkface, that'd be great, but we can't name him that. We could name him Sharky and then just call him that. Uh, Chomp Boy, Shark Week, Rough Skin, which I believe is ability. Uh, shark Week, Sharky, Chomper, Steve, Sharky, Sharky, Torpedo, Ugly Fish, Biggs McFin, Baby Shark, Jaws, Sharknado, Biggs McFin, I do like Biggs McFin, Biggs McFin, Biggs McFin is taken over. Sharpie don't. Biggs McFinn is taken over and seems to not have any serious competition. Folks, uh, it's all one word, but Biggs. McFinn, folks. Box one. We'll go take a look at Biggs McFinn real quick. That guy uh, was like, let me get in front of your bike real quick. Pedestrian are trying to... One of the few times I'm not on the side of the pedestrian. Alright, let's go over here. doing insurance fraud. Alright, what do we got for our Sharpedo? Hurts to touch. Rough skin. Uh, 35 attack, 27 special attack. Uh, defense, I would only, I can only describe as abysmal. Uh, bubble? 
Knock Off, Rock Throw, and Vice Grip. So um, he'll be a backup for us. We're not switching into Biggs McFinn right now. Is a missile not left meant to last? Yes. Um, I'm not scolding the design of the Pokemon, nor am I uh, applying a value judgment to that. I'm just saying uh, it's bad. All right, let's go up here. <laughs> uh, how many Pokemon can you catch in your challenge? Uh, only the first one on each route. So that was the first one we encountered on that route, which is why we were able to catch that one. Um, and now, actually, we're going to this area. And this is another new area, of course, the Fiery Path. Typically, you would be able to catch a Numel in this area, if I remember correctly. Um, and I do. However, and also Slugma, I believe. The only Pokemon we can catch on the Fiery Path is a Kecleon. Uh, the, only the very first one that pops up. Kecleon is like another, if we get like wiped, she'll be like a nice like alternative, you know? Um, nothing is not very effective against normal. You might be surprised, Joker. You might be surprised. Kind of a gimmicky Pokemon, but fun and good design, yeah. He's, he's, he's definitely gimmicky. Um, I thought we were just gonna get him. Is she dancing to Thriller? She is. That's her secret move. The power of the... Uh... Excuse me, sir. Go to bed. Go to bed, sir. Wow. 17 damage without a crit, so um, if he hits another one, we have to we have to heal or switch or something, but we got him. So, okay, Cleon was caught. She is, is a uh, Pokemon that has the ability to alter its body colors to match its surroundings. Cleon reverts to its original colors if it is startled. Cleon training on the fiery path and learning Blaze Kick. Cleon got Thriller, Houdini. Um, it is Joker. Got a couple Houdinis, some tricks up the sleeve, Solid Snake. Keklea. <laughs> Just Kek. Uh, Liquid Snake. That's too long, I'm afraid. I'm sorry. Houdini. Houdini. A couple of Houdinis there. Kickly on the professional, nice. Thriller. So it's it's leaning Houdini right now pretty hard. Anybody with anything other than Houdini? Now is your chance. Houdini. Houdini. It's normal, but it changes uh, based on what the last move to hit it was, Strawberry Bunny. Um so if you hit it with a water move, it becomes water type. But Houdini is the winner. Transfer to someone's PC. Whose PC was it transferred to? All right, folks, every time. Nail that joke, I'm so good at it. All right, um, put this person up there. Then we're gonna go over to get some experience there. Ah, yes, strength, which we'll be able to do after the next gym. Putting Houdini in a box, yeah. That is funny. That's very funny. The fiery path, dude! Check out the fiery path! I would have liked to have Charmeleon. However, I do not, and so we will fight it with... Pss, 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 pss. <laughs> Holy cow, there's a Kecleon on my PC now. It's a shame that we cannot catch it, but... Goodbye, Charmeleon. It was nice knowing you. 
Could have had Char Charlizard. Charlie Lizard. All right. This is Route 112, which is the same route, right? Yes. Okay. So we can't catch a Pokemon here. Bum, 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 bum. Dude, I love some Rost Berries. Definitely not Strawberries, dude. Rost Berries. Oh, you'd forget about it quickly, Joker. WWE Ross. Wonder what secret power will be. I also wonder. He's got a stab boost. I'm not gonna risk it. I'm not gonna risk my sweet child. It's especially weird that it's a sand shrew, though. Do we have the high ground here? We probably would have killed it. Sand shrew does not have great special defense. Uh, probably could have one shot it, but I wasn't sure. Didn't want to take the risk in case he used like mud shot and got a crit. So I said no, thank you. It's over, Sandikin. Three more special attack. You do love to see it. It's a shame we don't have an Obi-Wan pun Pokemon. Wh wh how are there so many of these things? Go to sleep, Dragonair. I just, I just, I don't understand how there's so many of them. Shed skin cured its sleep problem. Okay. Go to sleep. It's only like a one in three chance or something to have that happen. Do I have some catnip? Does it happen every turn? Does shed skin just happen every turn? Am I mistaken? Or am I just again getting the worst luck that you could possibly have? Ah, oh boy, one in nine. All right, let's go for one in 27, buddy. Worst luck, worst luck. Cool, 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 Okay. Here we go. How? Thank you. Thank you for not waking up four in a row. Dragonairs, man. These Dragonairs, man. I get that he just had like this. That's the same level Dragonair. No, not quite. Oh, it's a great, a great dragon design. I love that dragon design. Um, that's a slightly higher level dragon, Dragonair than the first gym. Okay. Aren't you an adorable trainer? Please, I need a romantic battle. I'm somewhat decent. This lady's all over the place. I'm glad to hear it, the one machine. Hi! <laughs> what is this? What is going on? Okay. Um, okay, I, <laughs> I 
Is Dragon Air special? Is Dragon Attack uh, special in this generation? I forget. Is Dragon special or is it uh, normal? Is it physical? <laughs> Oops! All Dragon Air. Oh my gosh! And yeah, I have to be just so careful. It does not depend. Okay, so I. <laughs> That free answer from chat is so funny. All at the same time. Physical, depends, and dragon is special. <laughs> okay. Dragon is special. Okay. We got three. Okay. And then dragons are special, which I believe is a joke. Um, okay. Damage. Okay. So you have a, you have a source. I'm going to trust the person with the source. I'm gonna go for the side beam, see what we can do here. Half health, payday, hopefully it does less than 14. Good, 10, we're safe, we just kill him. And if not, if he's at one, um, because I believe this one rounds up to make it orange health, we got him. All right, another Pokemon, Plusle. I will fight the Plusle. I'm not gonna bother with the 30 HP. Let's be on here. Ghost is physical. Ghost. I know Ghost is physical. It's all, so special is all of the EV evolutions, and I knew it was one other, and I was pretty sure it was Dragon. Oh, thank you very much, Praetor. I agree. I agree. A very cool. Pss, 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 the most recent addition to our squad. Um, we did actually catch a Sharpedo since. Uh, however, Sharpedo is a trash Pokemon, and he has a trash move set. So we didn't add him to the team. But... Oh, how strong you are! You've given me quite a shock. My, how strong you are, grandmother, or whatever. Um, okay, so I was trying to do Little Red Riding Hood there, and I got it backwards. Um, I'm gonna. I don't, I don't have any more um, potions, do I? Just plain potions. That's the... Uh... Sandstorm is vicious. I need a mock bike to get up this thing. There's like a rest station up here, if I remember correctly. It's not trash. It's just not on the lead end, lead level of the rest of the team. That's true. Do I have an HM slave? No. Um... Mega Drain with the defense lowered, I believe two more hits should do the trick. Get the hit. Alright, good, 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 good. Sirachi strikes back, hopefully not. Alright, here we go. Get the kill. Get the kill, bud. Come on, swag around. Be the god slayer that I know you are. Be the god slayer that I know you are, buddy. Let's go. Get him. Yes, dude. The god slayer in the flesh. Alright, see you around, Lady Yuck. A Metacham. Um, fighting Psychic type. Uh, let's go to Earth. Mm. Boy. Type coverage is not amazing. I guess Ed Clamps resists Psychic very well. Um, and only neutral for fighting, but has good defense, right? 46, not the worst defense. It's Ed Clamps. Vital throw. Let's see how much it does. Oh. So Silver Wind will be strong against him. I'm a little worried here. Um... 
He'll be super effective against Boombox. Do I go to Ivy League? No, because Ivy League has poison. Um, do I go to Earth Vader? What's Earth Vader's defense looking like? 59. Worse special defense doesn't resist psychic, but I think Metacham's special attack is worse. Yeah, about 50-50, about right? Um, I'm gonna go to Earth Vader, who has his better defense. I wasted a hit there, unfortunately, on Ed Clamps, but I didn't realize it was gonna do that much damage. Good thing I switched, because if that hit, it would have killed him. Um, and now we can go ahead and bone rush him. Damn, dude. Chosen one. <laughs> uh hits three hits three cross chops in a row and crits on the last one. I forgot that crits ignored defense raises. I was like, it'll be fine even if he crits. Dude, this Metacham is kind of sick with it. Oh, I'm afraid to use Boombox, dude. You think Boombox can blitz him? I think we have to try. Yeah, it might be sport. We've seen two fighting moves. Ah, oh, man. That hurts. That hurts. I think a crit on Boombox might kill. It was 27 on Earth Vader, not super effective. 57 defense. So super effective will be 54 or more. Crit will be a kill on him. No, Boombox, a crit on Boombox kills. A crit on Boombox kills. We have to try sporing him with Ivy League. We haven't seen a psychic move, and so we have to try Ivy League. I know it's I know it's scary because we love Ivy League so much, but we have to we have to go for this. We have to go for the spore. We might lose Ivy League. Yeah, I mean that's the nature of the game. Sometimes you have to risk losing a Pokemon to win a battle. This is Emerald. Yes. Uh, yes, dude. Okay. Whew. That hurts. That really does hurt. Earth Vader is going to hell. Damn, dude. Damn. Mmm. Mmm. And we're not even done with a trainer. Busts out a Yanma. Why can't he go to heaven? That's the rules, dude. You see the rules over there? Oh, he has speed boost. I didn't know that. I remember Yan Mega. Yan Mega is a cool evolution. I am so shocked by that. It stunk, dude. That stunk. I request a rematch, buddy. You killed one of our best friends. I don't know if I'm going to be able to just, like, battle you. Alright, I'm going to go back through Fiery Path, which has Kecleons and Charmeleons. We'll see what else it has, but... Um, we do... <laughs> Vader will return as a Force Ghost, yes. Um, Electabuzz. That would have been a cool one, too. That's alright. That's alright. Now we have to choose who's coming on the team. It might end up being, uh, might end up being our little uh, Sharpedo that I just shit talked. It's the danger of shit talking a Pokemon in a uh, Nuzlocke run. <laughs> uh, 
Snubble, I'm glad we did not get this one. I would have been upset if we caught Snubble in this cave. Oh, whoops. Let's go ahead and heal off that Snubble damage real quick. Kecleon does have Blaze Kick. Snubble sucks, dude. A mediocre normal type? What? Me use a mediocre normal type? Never. Um, Snubble is the only good dog Pokemon. That's an insane take. That take is the worst take I've ever heard. We could go back to, uh, uh, Corvid, yeah. Who has Dark and Flying, which is two, two types we need. Yeah, it might be Corvid. Out of the nice zone, out of retirement. Like, I can't believe you're not even considering Hound Doom right now. You're not considering Suicune, Entei, and Raikou. You're not consider like, come on. Arcanine. Ah, oh, this one hurts, guys. This one hurts. Welcome to hell, Earth Vader. We raised you from a baby. We changed your name. We had two names for you. <laughs> Bees nuts. Okay. Um, Corvid's back in action, folks. And if he'd hit Bone Rush, he would have been fine. If he'd hit Bone Rush, we were good. He would have he, he would have killed that Met Metacham. So it's like it's tough. It hurts. What's up, Kim? We're mourning a little bit. Our uh, uh, Sand Slash just died to a Metacham. Um, who used cr cross chop and critted um, for uh, 300 base power? Ugh, insult to injury, dude. Insult to injury. Yeah, cross chop. Uh, 300 base power move uh, through the raised defense that I, I had just used a uh, I think we get rid of Twin Needle here. Yeah. Sucks because we're going to have to get rid of like Super Fang probably if, if he gets a dark move. Right? Nobody else has worse moves so yeah. Oh yeah, we should we should quickly check uh, we should quickly check Kecleon and just see what Kecleon's deal is and what stats we're looking at because Kecleon did have Blaze Kick, um, so it's worth it's worth a check. I don't think I think his stats are pretty horrible. That special defense is kind of sick, actually. Good special defense. Um, try attack. And blaze kick. Try attack is good. We do have a normal type with try attack already. Um, but we could take try attack, blaze kick, and then see what else he learns. Um, what's your special attack looking like? 25 at level 15. <sighs> I don't think I don't think the single fire coverage is better than um, having flying and potentially dark coverage. Um, we're staying with Corvid, but we could teach him Rock Smash. Oh no, baby. Read the room, Streamlabs. Unbelievable. Horrible behavior from Streamlabs right now. We're upset. Can you not tell from the slight dip in my energy levels? Root 
112. What do we got here on Route 112, folks? A Togepi! That would have been pretty cool. That would have been pretty cool. I also don't want Corbett to go to hell. Um, that doesn't mean he gets a free ride, though. Everybody's got to earn their keep in this in this world. A Togepi with Water Pulse. Who gets the confusion every time. We're going for it. Making me proud. I knew this smart Pokemon wouldn't hurt themselves. 148, folks. Can I offer you an egg in this trying time? Thinking hard in an egg. All right. Psst, 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 psst. No worries that you've gotten uh, that lowered. Let's go ahead and side beam this uh, snubble. Decent damage from you. Um, not decent enough, though. Uh, they're like a fox. Uh, all the all the EV evolutions are like foxes. I think we've had this conversation in a different stream too. All right. So I'm just gonna switch because I I I know. Pss, 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 um, <laughs> no, they're cats. I think we, you and I, have had this conversation, and yeah. Well, Fox is basically in the dog family. Yeah, yeah, canine, canine. Yeah, that could have been bad. That could have been horrible. That might have killed, and I'm so glad I did what I did. A stab boosted flail when um, I guess his side beam would have probably brought him to one. The Eevee family is not cats. And it is very obvious. This is the guy that gives secret power. I remember this guy. Dun, 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 dun. They're not cats! <laughs> They're not cats. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're literally wrong. Um, I need to quit this game. I don't, I growl, dude, like, what is going on? This guy took up like nine, <laughs> nine lines of dialogue to give me a TM for growl. I would say one of the worst moves in the game. Um, he's in the other room, he's, he's sleeping. new meta. <sighs> oh, lower attack on all enemies by one level. Cat or dog-like creature. They are foxes, though. Rest up. I, I always found this particular area, I always thought something, I thought this was like a trap because of this. What a weird thing to put in a Pokemon game.
trying to spot some up and coming new talent in the field. We turn our lens on the trainer Phil Jr. There's something about this trainer that piqued our interest. The best way to determine how strong a trainer is, well, the fastest way is to battle. And so we began our investigation. That's how we ended up in the battle with Phil Jr. In a dominating performance, we were flattened, rolled up, and tossed aside, ruthlessly strong. Here's our impressions after having battled our featured trainer, the combination of Sand Slash and Sister. <laughs> Vader. No. 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 <sighs> Awful. I need info on this sport. I'm going to challenge Serena Williams to a tennis match. Wow, she's good. Hey, a raspberry. It's a great summary now, yeah. So is it that we just happen to show up at the times we're on TV, or are we the most covered, covered topic on TV? We happen to show up at the time. Because any other time you check the TV, I believe it says, like, the news is playing, or, or just, like, something, like... <laughs> she deployed an excellent combination of forehands and backhands to kick my ass. Okay, now I'm horrified of every trainer I fight. This route has been brutal. This route has been brutal so far. Absolutely a nightmare. And now we're getting a little bit of a break, apparently. And I just in time did. Getting a break just in time. We needed it. Great. Sweep him. Sweep them. All right. Uh, he has Blaze Kick. And try it. You know what? I'm not going to risk the try attack stab boost. I'm going to Boombox. We're going to beat him. Try attack stab boost might be dangerous. Are cool trainers and ace trainers the same? I forget. Um, the, it becomes cool trainers become ace trainers if I remember correctly. Yes, dude. Boom, boom, boom. Good, good, good. Got him. Nice, 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 nice. They didn't just look strong. They are strong. Cool Trainer Brook. I remember Cool Trainer Brook. Used to train uh, using Match Call with Cool Trainer Brook. Oh my god, yes, the frickin' Ash dude. Frickin' Ash Ketchum is what I'm about to do. You ready, folks? The only Pokemon we can catch in the Ash Zone is. <laughs> That's so funny! That is very funny. That is very funny. Another spare. I don't think this counts as dupes claws, right? What do you what do you guys think? Let's do a quick 1 minute poll for whether uh pre-evolutions count as dupes claws if I can if I can decide um does do pre evolutions count in dupes clause? Yes, can't catch. No. Can. No. Can catch. Or. Yes, can catch. No, can't catch. What am I doing?
they do count in dupes clause or not. One minute, pull, go. Yes, dupes clause is an optional cop out. I do play with dupes clause in general. So if you have a Pokemon already and it's the first Pokemon you encounter on a route, you can instead encounter Pokemon until you catch, until you encounter a Pokemon that is not. Yes, I can re-roll until I find um, something. So if it count, if it counts in Dupes Clause, essentially what it's saying is I can. This poll sucks, doesn't it? Yeah, the the poll sucks. Mut, yeah, must the poll sucks. The poll sucks. All right. The poll sucks. Okay. I, I I'm doing it. I'm I'm ending poll because the poll sucks and everybody's saying the poll sucks. I'm sorry. I suck at things. Okay. Uh, do <laughs> this is a Shan dear poll. Okay. Do I have to catch Lyron? No. Dupes clause applies. Or yes, dupes clause does not doesn't. No dupes. How's that? This is this is very clear. One minute. No or yes. Take it easy, Phil. It's just the poll that sucked, not you. And who made the poll? Spice slicer. Santa Claus. No, it was me. <laughs> no negative self-talk, Phil. Uh, in case you couldn't tell, I watched a Nicolas Cage movie yesterday. Are you Santa Claus, Phil? What is Dupes Clause? Dupes Clause says if you've already caught uh, a Pokemon, then you don't have to catch it. And I have uh, Agron, who is the evolved version of Lyron. So the question is, does Dupes Clause apply here? Do I have to catch Lyron, or can I try to find something else? Question, are there any other Pokemon on this route, or is it all Spinda? Because it might not, it might be a moot point. Oh, sorry, that was a cheers for the one machine. There's two Pokemon, okay. Okay, but one of them is rare, okay. So no, I don't have to catch Lyron. I can get rid of the Lyron. And you think there's Spoink too, right? Okay. All right, we will continue. If this is not a Lyron, the only Pokemon we can catch on this route is Mankey. What's up, Grim Reaper? Mankey, folks. Weird. Let's spore him. Ah, vital spirit. Can't put him to sleep. Because his spirit is vital. I feel nothing about Mankey. Don't kill him. I'm on it, Zed. All right. When it starts shaking and his nasal breathing turns rough, it's a sure sign of anger. However, since this happens instantly, there is no time to flee. Mankey will kill you. All right. Give a nickname. Well, I have Agron already, Spice Slicer. Manka? This monkey will kill you. He will. Okay, so we got Stanky, Mank Stank, Monka, Monka, Prime Rib, Stan Key, Woman Key, because it is a female monkey. Um, in the anime, it steals Ash's hats. That's true. That's true. Uh, is it a prime? It's a primate, though. 
Or does it steal? I forget. It evolves at some point. I think someone punts it and it evolves. It's like messed up. Blanky. Hat thief. I've done woman key in my own playthrough, so I refuse. Mankey E. Anna Mankey. Karibo. Oh, yeah. Why, 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 why did you just pitch and immediately one up a oh, yeah? <laughs> Pog chimp. We got four pog chimps there. I think pog chimp is winning. Uh, yeah, has a couple, a couple, but Pog Chimp seems to be the winner. Pog Chimp. <laughs> That's a good name. That's a good name. Mankey named Pog Chimp. This music is freaking stanky, dude. Stanky Mankey with it. Alright. Ah. Good name for a mon that we probably won't ever use. Right two hands, am I right? High five. Psh. Leaf blade him. Pog chimp evolves into pog chump. Oh, I wasn't expecting him to be a trainer. Can you guess why it's so cool around here? Uh, the ash is blotting out the sun. That's what I think he's going to tell me. Ah, perfect. A zoom roll. In Sword Shield, it's implied the uh, Pokemon have a little life inside the box. It's true. Uh, and in the anime, uh, they show like a, a x-ray or something of a Pokeball, and they're just like sitting in a ball. They're just like, they just shrink slightly smaller than the ball. So, uh... Pick your truth, I suppose. This stinks. And now tell me the fact. I love that. He's like, do you know why it's so cool here? Go, Azumarill. She's dead. This stinks. The volcanic ash covers up the sun's rays. Let's get the uh, Ivy League's level 27. We gotta, we gotta get someone else there. Um, let's put maybe Swagran out front or Corvid or Pinbox. Let's get Swagran out front. Oh, that's right. There's like, uh, what is it? Is like the trainer type is like Ninja Kid or something? Dude loves that streamer, huh? Um, let's go Swagron and now let's do pss, 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 and uh, Boombox. Just we have to we have to make sure we're for double battles we're good. Thanks for finding me, but we still have to battle. You may be in the middle of gathering volcanic ashes. Not yet. Yeah, Ninja Boy Lung. His name is Lung, and he's on the uh, Ash route. Can I just not have this occur to me anymore? Lung, did. Go to Swagron here, and go ahead and just try attack the hell out of that Lugia. Oh boy. Yes, dude, he has Peck. Yes, dude, this guy has my luck. This guy's got my luck. All right. Goodbye, Lugia. Got the Lugia, got the Lugia. You love to see it, you love to see it.
swag round leveled up as well. Yeah, Lungia. Oh, he's got more! He's got a Chansey as well. Another uh, professional kit here. Just like a uh, friggin' Chansey Lugia kit. Pretty, pretty good stuff. Borderline, like, competitive. Like, all he has to do is upgrade that to a Blissey, and he's got, like, got a trash defense, but incredible uh, HP. Luckily, I'm nine levels higher, but, um, yes. Orenberry Blissey, competitive set. Seal! Got a Lugia and a Chansey on one of them, and a Seal and a Larvitar on the other. The laziest. Absolutely the laziest. Got an Ancient Power Him and just Karate Chop. About that. Chansey with double team in the Battle Frontier? Oh no. That sounds horrible. That sounds rough. a good, nice, even level. Kinesis, huh? Let's take a look at what Kinesis is. An 80% uh, psychic. He learns a psychic move, and it's an 80% chance to lower accuracy. Nice job, bud. You really killed it there. You really you really killed it. I can't be too mad at Boombox. Boombox has uh, tri-attack. As long as he's got tri-attack. You know? I'll use my ninjutsu on you. Volcanic Ash Swirl Cloak. What? It's already open. Look! Behind you! <laughs> if you think about it, Mewtwo is a pretty lazy name. It is indeed. Y you want to battle with me? <laughs> okay, Pokemaniac Wyatt. Just caught an Iggly buff, huh? Dude's just foo-foo-fooing over here. With his Iggly buff. Get out of here. Venomoth. Alright. Ugly no buff, am I right? Yeah, freaking low tier Pokemon. Can't buff you gotta you gotta get a buff to be relevant this situation. Right, folks? <laughs> okay. Rested. Dustox is cool. I'm very surprised we haven't seen a Dustox yet. Also, I would love to have a Dustox instead of a Beautifly. Instead of Flyconic. Phil found one X Defend. And... That's very funny that I just found a Yellow Flute. That's very funny that I just found a yellow flute right there. I think, yeah, it's a good, it's a good flute. Uh, great flute, top tier flute. Um, it cures confusion. Um, let's go to Ed Clamps and just freaking sky uppercut this Lyron. Peeps are made out of boiled Iggly buffs. It's a very relevant... Okay. I think it might be where you find that flute. If not, then you um, can build it with the... Uh, by collecting ash in this area. I'm not talking about ketchup. <laughs> Ed Clamps gained 152 experience. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. He has Iron Defense, Metal Sound. I can't risk a powerful steel attack coming through. It feels so funny. He should be an internet comedian. Not a real one, but just like an internet comedian. He's that, he's that funny. Rock Slide. Might have been dangerous. Did 14 to Ed Clamps. 
probably would have done more to our 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 boy. Pss, 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 pss. This is a long route, huh? This is a very long route. I see why there's that lady that wants you to rest a lot. Ed Clamp's getting a little bit of defense IVs as well, as is, uh, which is good. Give him the clamps, boss. Give him the clamps. What do we got here? I'm gonna pump up Boombox with that, even though it's only 20 HP. Um, it could feasibly end up being necessary. I use this parasol to ward off this filthy, yucky volcanic ash from my dear Numel. Let's see uh, what your new Mel has grown up to become. Dead is what it's grown up to become. Goodbye. Uppercut has a whole new meaning with those clamps. It really does. Boom. All right, Fratriarch. Have a good seafaring trip. Expedition. Huff, huff, I am exhausted. Here, slide under my parasol. Okay, parasol lady, Madeline. I love how that's a type. Just parasol lady. It sounds like a roast. Uh, yeah, it's that parasol lady. I think you literally become a parasol lady by having a parasol. I think that's it. All right, what do you got? Magneton and Matang. I do wish I had Blaze Kick right about now. Um, so we'll go over to Boombox here. And we will use Iron Tail on, I think probably Magneton's more dangerous. Swagron can't switch out, also, is another thing. Oh, boy. Good, good, huge. Fine. Fine. Very good defense on our boy here, so... Shouldn't have to worry too much about it. I'll do this as well, just in case the Karate Chop doesn't quite kill him. Did. So Iron Tail will go in on the Tang now. No, it won't. Ice Ball. That's fine, dude. You go ahead and use Ice Ball, bud. Steel Wing this. Come on, dude. All right, Ice Ball a little bit more, but still not very effective. Worst case, two more turns of that will get it. I'm not even going to affect how quickly he dies, so. <laughs> Swagron having a real rough go of it today. I'm just going to use uh, Ancient Power for the guaranteed kill. If not, okay, there we go. Swagron can't hit a dang thing, dude. Surely cannot. Couldn't win. Win. It's boring. Okay. Masquerade. Dude. Has intimidate. Did not know Masquerade had intimidate. Let's head on over to Corbett. Pokemon World does have universal health care. But only only for the um, Pokemon. One of your favorite Digimon, seriously, yeah. It's a good Digimon. 
Wish it was water type, water bug. Or water flying. Blue shard. Okay. Soot sack. Dude's like, I have lung issues. Oh, okay. It's fun to blow a glass flute while my boss is talking. Huff, 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 huff. Cute. Cute, buddy. Um, I think that's the town right there. Alright, whatever. Wahaha! -ha -ha! This guy's a Watson, dude! He's a Watson student. From out of the ashes, I leap. Swablu? Friggin' Watt, Watt Luigi over here. Am I right, folks? Get that side beam in. Yeah. It's fine. Oh uh, yeah, I think he has a straight up sword. One assumes it's a toy, but who's to say? Just in case he has like mega horn. Uh, we're gonna go to Ed, does Ed Climbs have a steel move? I just realized. I don't think he does. Yeah, he doesn't have a steel move. Um, I would go to Swag Round, but he's only 35. I don't want to, like, hit, like, Sonic Boom or something crazy. We're going to Boombox. Signal Beam could have been dangerous, I guess. Oh, yeah, his stats suck. He's got very good defense, but, like... <laughs> Moveset's killer, though. Moveset is ridiculous. Slinging mega kicks. Slinging signal beams. A mega kick from a shuckle that deals four damage is such a flavor victory, dude. What a flavor victory. Fun fact, signal beam is encrypted. Nice, Debbie. Nicely done. Leveled up. What else you got, bud? Torkoal! So we get our we get our Torkoal anyway. Our types randomizable, not of the Pokemon, no. Um Hey, a freeze from Tri-Attack. You'll love to see it. Are there any ice dragons in Pokemon? Shuckle Mega Kick is very funny, right? That little thing. Hitting you for four damage. <laughs> there is one QRM. What generation is that from? Encore! Great! Um, very badly, Ventusphere. That's why it does four damage. There's a Pokemon named Viserion. It's a black and white legendary. Gotcha. Is there a rock dragon? I think there is. Is there a rock fairy type? Diancy? Damn, you guys are on top of it. Is there a steel fairy type? Yes, there is. Mawile is a steel fairy type. The volcano's eruption is proof that the Earth is alive. Uh, this guy's posting JPEGs on Facebook, I think.
I'm about to sneeze, guys. I'm trying to predict it. Okay, great burn. Good job. Nice work, Typhlosion. Respect where respect is due. Credit where credit is due. Let's get a nice uh, burn heal on my friend here. Please don't tell me I can't heal. Oh, berries, berries, yes. Rost. Rost. Rost berry. Just a sick burn, dude. Missing uh, Earth Vader right about now. Okay, that did 23 damage, or 33 damage, rather. One of the two. Neither one will kill. Um, which means we have a chance to do a try attack here. Okay. Unfortunately, Fine Apple is not usable. All right, Youngster Dylan. Youngster is the best trainer in the game. It's the best trainer type in the game, and it isn't close. Thread the needle there to heal up, and then we'll go back and fight them. Yeah, Swagron is neutral to fire, but uh, has some of the worst special defense uh, on the team, and also was at 35 HP, so he would have died if we switched him. Could that be at the PC? It's a good question. The warmth here is making me drowsy, and these pretzels are making me thirsty. Someone's at the computer. Yeah. Uh, the amount that Birdkeeper Kobe looks like Gary is astounding. Okay, so Pinsir is dangerous, as is Dratini, because Dratini could have Dragon Rage. So we can't screw around, and we have to go to Boombox. Boombox, thank God we have Boombox. I'm going to Ancient Power the Pinsir, and we're going to gauge this Dratini. Because Ancient Power should kill the Pinsir. Good. It's not Temporany, but we think it every time. Everybody always says it's shiny. It's not. This is what it looks like. Um. We had the same thing happen when we were doing the Fire Red playthrough. Okay, fine. I remember Hyper Fang. I was like, oh, cool, dude. Very cool, like, seeming move. All right. Actually, I had to Google it. Yeah, no, we... we... I hate it. Dratini is blue. <laughs> Dragonair is blue. And then Dragonite is just yellow and big. Boombox hit level 30, dude. We made it. We've arrived at level 30. I feel confident we'll kill him before uh, he uses a fire blast on Swaggeron and kills him. Macargo is such a goofy Pokemon, dude. What? Yeah, enjoy, dude. Enjoy your dead Pokemon. Peace. Someone's PC. Don't we still have a Slugma with Sketch? We do indeed. Oh, hello. You are? Oh. Your name is Phil Jr. You can see you're a trainer. To use the Pokemon storage system I developed. How I arrived at that conclusion is a simple deductive process. You spoke to me because you wanted to access something on this PC. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm Lynette. Honestly, I'm glad to meet you. It's great you're using the storage system. If you could, please visit me at home. She's very smart. She used dedu deductive reasoning and named it. 
I love how everybody who likes stuff in this game is just called a maniac by everybody. <laughs> oh yeah, the fossil maniac. Lava Ridge Gym? I'm afraid not. Not made it to Lava Ridge Gym yet. Knew it. Berry juice, baby. Forbidden escargot. Professor Cosmo went off to Meteor Falls on Route 114 with some people from Team Magma. <gasps> See? Take a look. This is Azurul. Another battle tent here. May the greatest teams gather. Move Tutor's house. New moves taught to Pokemon. New moves taught to Pokemon? Ah, uh, okay. I have a heart scale, so I could do that, but... As a casual practitioner of deductive reasoning, I was very impressed with Lynette's use of it there. Um... I do wonder if the flutes are randomized. No, because you get it from a person, so... Items you get from people are not randomized, like the silk scarf and stuff were not. Unless I've had bizarre luck. Alright, Fossil Maniac's house. Let's take a look here. He's giving me a TM so I could dig holes like his big brother. The TM is Lovely Kiss. Demands a kiss with a scary face that induces. <sighs> I'm a nice guy who loves fossils. Look in the desert where there's boulders and sand where there may be fossils. Okay, then. Hmm. Bad. All of my TMs are trash except for Aeroblast, which is amazing. It's kind of funny. That would put you in a hole. That is true. Nice. Folks, thank you very much for joining. I appreciate it. And I'll catch you next time on the Phil Jameson Gets Horrible Luck on Pokemon Emerald Randomized with High Difficulty Stream. Rip to Earth Vader. <laughs>